Happy to have you here, and Derek's going to teach us about a new one called Don't Mess With Cthulhu. Yeah. Get that out of my way. I don't know if you're planning on keeping that there. If there's a side, I don't really have to bring it over here. All the way down there, maybe. All right, so just five of us. So we're each going to take one of these randomly. Uh, keep the identity to yourself. Um, there's two different choices. You can either be a cultist or a investigator. You'll probably be able to tell which of the two it is, uh, but for the reference, the cultist would be green and the investigator would be yellow. Just say on the bottom right too. There you go. Yes, it does. He's not <laughs> incorrect. This one stays out of the game, but we're not allowed to see it. Cool. If mine says on Cthulhu, what do I do? It does not say that. <laughs> he is in but, this deck right but here. But if it does. <laughs> if it does, then I'd like to see that. Look, okay, man, he's mystical. I don't have control over what he does. Please you just told him not to show you the card, so... Schrodinger's cast. I, I know all the cards. Once again, he's played often with himself. He knows. Yep. <laughs> no, that was actually just today to figure out how to play the fucking game. <laughs> playing with himself for the show. That's... Yeah, for the show, you dedication. know, I do what I have to do. Yep. That's real dedication. Mainly because I don't want to have to get in here and read through the rule books while we're trying to play. Fair. Like for that next game, that how, the Trail of House on the Hill. It was, it was a good, hefty, 20-page, small font rule book, but I suffered through that. Um, so everyone take these. Uh, these, I mean, you, you look at these and then don't show them to anyone else. Um, you're gonna see if you see like a tap, like there are gonna be tablets that are empty that are look kind of bluish, and then there are little stone tablets that may have a um, almost looks like a little leaf or tree kind of. That's an eldritch sign. Um, the point of the game is for the investigators to uncover all five of the eldritch signs before the cultists uncover Cthulhu. These cards are all gonna be spread out, and we're gonna be flipping them over. Um, with that, there are gonna be a couple other ones that have like special effects to them that as those are revealed we'll, we'll handle those but ultimately it's a social deduction game no one knows who's a cultist and who is a investigator uh, when they're spread out so once you know your your cards it says at the beginning of each round you can reveal like tell the tell the group like how many eldritch signs you have in your hand and how many cthulhu you have in your hand if you have that in your hand now you don't have to tell the truth the whole point is of this game is to know when to lie when to tell the truth it's kind of strategizing, like communications encouraged during the game of like when people are trying to select a card to reveal, like, okay, well, do you really want to reveal that or, you know, this and that. So the Eldritch ones have signs, Cthulhu ones of the plain tablets? So the plain tablet is just a plain tablet, okay. like it's nothing. Cthulhu, like there's only one Cthulhu card in the, oh, okay. In the game. Okay, okay. That And makes sense. Um, the, the cultists win it, so the investigators need to get all five signs revealed by the end of four rounds. Mm -hmm. um, if they don't get it by the end of four rounds, the cultists win. The cultists also win if um, Cthulhu is revealed before the end of the game, at any point. Mm -hmm. um, there is one Eldritch sign that is the Necronomicon, and if that one counts as an Eldritch sign, except it can't be the first one revealed, or the cultists win. It has to be after the first Eldritch sign is already out there. Okay. And basically, like once you know what cards are here, um, we're going to end up spreading those out like in front of yourself like this and then as the game goes you're going to be revealing cards that are face up in front of other or face down in front of other players um, to kind of narrow down or try to reveal the eldritch signs or cthulhu based on whatever side you're on already then interesting and so like for me i can say like I'll, like so i'll start like i'll tell the group i have two eldritch signs and zero cthulhu's in my hand. Okay. Now you can believe that or not believe that. It's up to you. That's the whole point. And then it would go to Amy and you say how much you have in your hand uh, amongst those cards. Okay. Well, I have no Cthulhu's. And can I, do I have to give a number or can I just say? I mean, you don't have to. Okay. Well, I've got no Cthulhu's and I have one Eldridge. Okay. Tyler? Uh... Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, Alright, I have no Cthulhu's and one Eldritch. No Cthulhu's and two Eldritch. 
What if I say I have multiple Cthulhu's? <laughs> I mean, you can say it. You could be like, I have two Cthulhu's, but everyone's gonna know. Everyone knows there's only one in the game, so you either have that one, or you're just bullshit and have zero. Like, who knows? At this point, if you also said no Cthulhu's, someone around the table bullshit. So, I mean. I have three Cthulhu's and one Eldritch. Gosh. <laughs> yeah, we're throwing you in a stock game. Okay. <laughs> Go for it. Wait, and what happens if the investigator has a Cthulhu? Well, so it doesn't matter necessarily what's in front of you. It's about what's revealed. Okay. And so, like, for example, if I'm, like, I'll start the round. I'll go first. So what's going to happen is I choose one of you four players, and I'm going to reveal one of your cards. So, for example, I'm going to flip this over. It's an empty one. It goes out here to the discard pile. Now, she takes over and chooses one of us, or chooses one of our cards. You can't pick the ones in front of you. So you're relying on other people to reveal yours if you have Eldritch signs. Mm -hmm. Well, depending on which team you are. If you have cards you want flipped over, you want them choosing from yours. Okay. And so, like, you just choose from one, just choose one card that doesn't, that's not in front of you, and flip it over. And so that's an empty one. So yeah, it just comes out here. This is the discard pile. Um, the round only consists of five revealed cards until the next round will start. Um, and not everyone's guaranteed to have a turn during the round. It's based off of like, now that she chose a card from Tyler, Tyler chooses the next card he wants to take from someone else. It can be back to her again, or it can be from someone else. Alright, so now you choose a card from somebody. Out of the three Cthulhu's that he could potentially have. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's like for example, if that were true, if he did have three, which is impossible, but theoretically, <laughs> if you're an investigator, you probably don't want to choose from him, because if you flip over Cthulhu, the cultists win. But if you are a cultist, then you might want to choose that, because you're like, oh, I have the greatest shot of getting what I want mm -hmm. in his pile. Mm -hmm. and that's why like, you either tell the truth or lie about whatever cards you have. So you could be just lying about the Cthulhu's, and you could be lying about Cthulhu's. Any of us could be, yeah. It's like true. Everyone All could be lying. Could be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. like we might never get a Cthulhu. It might all just be a ploy. It might be. All right, so now j Fred will choose the last card for the round. So Private Eye, secretly reveal your role to the investigator. So I have to show you my role, secretly. Mm-hmm. And then that goes in there. So what's going to happen now is these are out of the game now. Now we're going to gather up all these cards and reshuffle them. And deal them all out. Now everyone's only going to have four to start with. So as the game goes on, less that cards out nice. here. And so that's the end of the first round. So now there's three more before the game is over. If it doesn't end sooner than that. This is what I'm kind of shuffling. Right, like with them, mix it up, whatever. Fine. Whoop. Not gonna know. Anyway, so now. Kind of take some. And then look at them again. Yeah, look at them, say what you got. And then you shuffle them up. And we can talk to each other during this whole... Yeah, we can talk to each other. Now, it is imperative that once you look at them, you do shuffle them up before putting them down here, because you're not allowed to know where your own cards are either. Crying. Okay. And then now, since you're the first player, you reveal... Or, like, it'll pass to the left, so now you reveal what, like, you have in your hand, and we do that whole thing again. I have... Or I think it says you only have to in the first round. I guess you don't have to reveal in the second round, I guess. It said you may. I have two Eldridge cards amongst my four. I have zero Eldridge cards. I have one Eldridge card. Zero Eldridge cards. I have three, three Eldridge cards and zero Cthulhu's. Cool. Now, Amy, you get to make the first pull. Okay, right, where did the three mine. Cthulhu's go? <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, so, someone's lying about all the fucking octopus in here. <laughs> how we shot that octopus? Alright, um. I'm gonna go this. Good old cephalopod god, whatever you want to call it. Okay. First draw. Not yeah, too much, right? I, I mean, there's only a 1 in 20 
chance that you'll lose off this. Plus, also, like, <laughs> people could be lying, and I don't know what hands everybody's got. So that's oh, yeah. Really fun. True. Pretty sure somebody was lying. All you know. Nobody's revealed that they have a Cthulhu. Yeah. <laughs> All you know is out there amongst the cards, there are five Eldritch signs and one Cthulhu. Okay. And then a couple mystery like effect cards, kind of like that one he had last round. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think there are five of those, four of those. So I. Listen, I didn't know what you guys were talking about. Cthulhu, <laughs> <laughs> those tentacles. Yeah. I was like, Davy Jones. Yeah, I was going to really? say Davy Jones-ish. Um, okay, I think I'm going to pull from Derek's hand. Oh damn. Return Mirage. Return a previously discovered elder sign to the reshuffle. Well, so there's, we don't have one discovered, so you just put so that there. So there is the first draw. So I'll go next. I'm going to pull that one. Return all your unrevealed cards to the reshuffle pile. Okay, these cannot be earned this turn. So I'm just going to turn those sideways. And so now you get to go again. That is two cards. What? Well, I was just saying we've gone That's through two, two now for this round. They have to make a decision. I have to make another one? Mm-hmm. Oh, mm-hmm. I'm blessed. Okay, let's With see. With the pressure. <laughs> yeah. Well, if you weren't lying about having an Eldridge. Let's see. God damn it. <laughs> so we know Amy's an investigator. <laughs> <laughs> we know her role. Oh, no, that's four now. So you would take the last card. Then. Oh. <laughs> Slim pickings, I know. All right, so that's five. So now we shuffle up again. Wow. Yeah, nothing has been revealed yet. That's yeah. kind of... That's sus. Real, real <laughs> you say sus? Yeah. <laughs> Red sus. Investigate a sus. Hmm. Red is sus. Either shush me or I put it in. Sorry. Who did? Red. 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 I saw that. Oh, I saw yeah. that. <laughs> Before the game starts. As uh, Jayfred's the only one in red. Red's definitely sus. Sus. We had three Cthulhu's earlier. <laughs> that is pretty sus. And then they all disappeared <laughs> magically. That's <laughs> like, my fault. Pretty sus. So now Tyler reveals first. And he says what he's got. I have one Eldritch and one Cthulhu. I have one Eldritch, no Cthulhu. One Eldritch, zero Cthulhu. Zip, zip. One Eldritch. Now Tyler picks first for oh, somebody. Okay. Uh, this is easier. Nah. Do I want to give you another go? Uh, yeah. Let's see. Well, All right, so now we've revealed one. Okay, there we go. Not Tyler picks. Uh, can you grab your middle? Middle? Yeah. <laughs> Two. Two. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Reveal a card and flip it back over, so I can kind of just see what someone's got. Okay. Um, and then that makes it Jayfred's turn for the last card of the round. Mm. Wow. Well, that was a fun round. All right. <laughs> so that was very productive. A lot happened that first up. My turn. <laughs> for one of two teams. <laughs> I guess it kind of helps out the other team too, just because I mean, now there's a higher chance of drawing the Cthulhu out too. That's true. Because there's less cards total. I have six Cthulhu. <laughs> right? Half the deck is Cthulhu. That's where those three went. They're all multiplied. <laughs> Only has three cards. <laughs> Everyone has two now. And then you will reveal first. Yeah, I was about to say, whoa, 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 you don't get to know where they're no, at. I'm like, <laughs> what are you doing? Trigger! Uh, I got one, one Eldritch. That's it. One Cthulhu, zero Eldritch. 
I've got zip zip. Nothing. Zero zero. Right, so now you are first to draw. You went first last, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, uh, this is the final round. So um, if the investigators don't reveal all five of these, then they lose after this round. Oh, there's five? Yeah. Five. Uh, there's four. There's one for each player that's in the game. Oh, okay. Oh, I go first? No, I think oh. she goes first. Oh. That's what I thought. Mm. This one? Hold that one. Oh, me. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh, I read the oh. rules, but you know, they're kind of fuzzy. Right. <laughs> I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with no, 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 no. two. Don't fuck this up. This card is real. She can no longer communicate. <laughs> All right. So she's not allowed to say or convince anyone of anything. But you do get to draw a card now <laughs> from somebody. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so depending on what team you are. All right. Tyler makes the last draw of the game. All right, game over. Do we reveal who we want? You did have it. <laughs> I did. You kind of bluffed me. Oh wait, so there's only four. That counts as one. This counts. It, as one? it just oh. can't be. It just can't be the first one that's drawn. Oh. If I had known that, I would have picked that one before. Yeah, I wonder oh. why you didn't. Yeah. I said that at the beginning of the game. I was like, uh, the Elder Sign. I said one of them is an Necronomicon, but it can't be the first one that's drawn because then the cultists win. Oh, okay. You were a cultist too? I was a cultist. Oh, I didn't get that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That was some sort of professor in Egypt, I'm guessing. <laughs> and so now, since the cultists won for the box go, everyone who was on the investigator side takes one of these insanity tokens. Congrats. And so at the end of, like that was just one, that was like one quick game. Okay. Usually a session is like three, I mean you can go more than three, but three. And who, at the end of the three, whoever has the least amount of these is the winner. Okay. Those are basically like loser tokens. Yay, we did But everyone exciting. changes roles every game, too. Now I gotta mix these up real good. Yeah, put those like random places throughout the deck here. Yeah, if you want to throw those in randomly as well, too. Yeah, we'll put one in there. We'll, we'll do one. 52 card pickup, go. Um, we'll... There. Yeah, you want to mix those up for me. No, yeah, just so we're clear on the second one. Yeah, the Necronomicon is one of the five elder signs or elder signs. It uh, it just can't be the first one that's revealed. Makes okay. sense. Though. Can we say that we have the Necronomicon? You would just call it an elder sign. Okay. You can reveal like what elder signs in Cthulhu you have, but you can't specify if it's the Necronomicon. Yeah, okay. You're not supposed to, uh, from what I read. I have one Nelder card. You have one what? Nelder card. Nelder card. <laughs> Nelder. Just have a little bit of a speech impediment. Yeah. yeah. It's the only time I've ever had that particular <laughs> speech impediment. So you guys are all mixed up. You guys know I was always able to say words. I kind of just like. <laughs> oh, I wasn't watching, so I didn't know if you did. They kind of just went around, and uh, you know. That's awkward. Yeah. That's six ones. What the fuck you doing, man? Actually, I'll just leave that one out since it's pretty even with two and three. So otherwise, it could just be one cultist against everyone else on that side. <laughs> or one is investigated. That would also suck. No, there's, <laughs> out of the six cards, there's two cultists and four uh, of the four of the investigator. So it's easier for the cultists to win, technically. Yeah. Someone could, the cultists could win on the very first draw of the game, technically. Be very lucky, but when I was playtesting earlier, I actually did do that. Yeah, you're playing with yourself. Yeah. You Look, bitch. Yourself win. <laughs> I, I get that. Thanks. Can I have multiple personalities. It's okay. Yeah. Pretty, pretty. I don't know why I was looking at all this shuffling up. It's like that doesn't do anything. I mean, honestly. All right, so you can start this one. Thing. Just do it. Turn to start yet? I have zero zero. Oh, I guess me. I have one elder sign and zero Cthulhu. I have one elder sign, zero Cthulhu. Two elder signs, one Cthulhu. 
Two on the side, so zero Cthulhu. There is no Cthulhu now. Interesting. Oh, okay. Yeah. There we go. So you go first, Jacob. It's Cthulhu! Oh, and the <laughs> cultist win. <laughs> Who's the cultist? I knew that was going to fucking happen as soon as he said. There we go. Good one. Okay. So, go ahead and pass out a token to everyone else. <laughs> I'm just kind of reshuffle these up real quick. That's some real shit. That was real quick. That was so good. I was going to go for him because he said he had Cthulhu. And I was like, wait, that's going to make it really obvious. I thought that too. I was like, if I do my first guess on Tyler, they're going to be like, he's looking for Cthulhu. Yeah. That's what I was going to be like. No. Did you get a thing? Oh, no. Never that. She got one. I was a normal person who got got. Who got got. With the insanity. Who got screwed. <laughs> the little octopus. Last fella. round. Kind of looks like he has eyes with an eyebrow. <laughs> I see it. <laughs> And then some spots. A little sad, almost, not sad, but a little more concerned. Like, oh, are you okay? Nervous, <laughs> kind of. Should you? Two Elder Signs and one Cthulhu. I have one Cthulhu and one Eldridge. You said what? The, is it Eldridge? The, the Elder Sign? Yeah. Elder Sign, thank you. Yeah. You said zero Cthulhu or one Cthulhu? One Cthulhu. One Cthulhu. Uh, I have one Cthulhu and no Eldridge. Everyone's got Cthulhu this round. <laughs> I, guess I, have, so. I have zero zero. You might. So. The zero Cthulhu is two Elder Signs. That's pretty good. I was saying, can I try it? But oh. <laughs> I was like, I, it, I was like, ignored. <laughs> oh. I did not hear what you said. Sorry, I didn't hear it either. I was looking at. I it. do kind of like that. Yeah. Kind of looks like tater tots. Oh, what? That, that part, part until now. That part, so. no. <laughs> yeah. From the angle that um, I was at. Yeah. I can see that. Which one of the Cthulhu's are the you going to choose? Oh, for Tyler's Cthulhu, and it was nothing. <laughs> uh, I'll grab your second to your right. That's okay. Yeah, curses. Wait, again. Your turn. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, like, so Dave. remember what everybody had anymore. Uh, who's, had a pro, who's a pro tip? I, I had private. a... This one? Private eye. Secretly reveal your role to the investigators. I'll show you what I am. That's so actually a good card to pull because then you can eliminate who's who. Yeah, you can kind of see what people are mm -hmm. scheming. And skip me. And uh, last pick of the round. Maybe. That's me. Okay. Interesting. I'm going to go with Tyler. Oh, damn. All right. So those are out. Oh, now we can reshuffle all the cards. Let's throw them out there. Mixy, mixy. Mixing, mixing. It's a technical term. Yeah, very technical, very technical. Us in the uh, in Probably. the game world, you oh, know, okay. this is these are proper verbiage. You know, I thought I'd been in the game world for a little while, but you know what? You learn something new every day, don't you? You don't go on the site. I say you're still you're, you're still level two apparently. Oh, so. thanks. Once you once you once you ascend, you I don't I thought the summer meant something to you guys. I guess not. You don't even have the proper road. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Look, this is this is a date outfit. I don't go to dates on robes. What? And that's why you're not a true gamer. <laughs> <laughs> I can't let them know on the that's first go. I can't you're let right. them know. Thank you. <laughs> don't get too excited. I need to rein it in a little. Instead, I just wear all black. I feel like that's a good way to communicate my feelings. It's just 
<laughs> I know to communicate to them that. Or your last night dope feelings, maybe? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna say that I'm dead inside. That's what the girls need <laughs> to know. You know about black is the amalgamation of all the colors. I was like, where am I the cargo? I was like, oh, we only have four this time. Who took it? Amy, you reveal first. I have a little power now, huh? That's one way to look at it. I have. No, I'm <laughs> 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 Gotta have balance here, Tyler. Okay. I have. I'm trying to make a feel involved. <laughs> one Cthulhu. How many Cthulhus do you have? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, they're just speaking in tongues. I don't know what that means. I meant more of like what you got in your car. <laughs> <laughs> I have, they're uh, just hissing. <laughs> two elder and zero Cthulhu's. I also have two elders and zero Cthulhu's. One elder and zero Cthulhu's. Uh, four elders, one Cthulhu. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> so, <laughs> I mean, you I draw. Or, no, you have a secret fifth card, huh? <laughs> <laughs> he was asking about it earlier. <laughs> Okay, I got a little sus, who knows? <laughs> I mean, you are. Everything about you. There's wow. Mine. Just take your turn, Tyler. <laughs> uh, I'm going to grab that one from you. This one? Yeah. She goes to Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Oh, it's me. I'm going to that one. Motherfucker, cultist one. <laughs> God damn it. Why? I was even the same investigator as last time. I was an investigator for once. I was the same cultist that was last time. So y'all cultist, so all three of us get one. Oh, they're going to be coming back from this. And so that was three games, right? I'm seeing. Mm-hmm. So how many do you have, Tyler? Three. three. How many do you have, Amy? I have now two. Two. I have one, you have one. You have two. Yeah. Tie. My my two little concerns. Yes, nuggets. we can do one more round. I'm trying to see colors out of space. We get on the same team though. It's not. It's not gonna solve anything. It's true. <laughs> do you want to take this card, or we just don't need them? I didn't say that. Congrats. That's I'm gonna shut them off my sleeve. <laughs> just pull them out later. Yeah. I have one Cthulhu. <laughs> <laughs> when did that one come into play? I'll just pass one out to everyone, please. It's good enough. Oh. I have to mix it up then. Who's the last inspector? Cthulhu. Alright. Cthulhu. What do we got here, boys? Right, Amy, or I think you should have last one. Tyler. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Tyler. What'd you got, Ty? I have zero and zero. How about you? What you got over there? Uh, two elder, zero Cthulhu. You? One elder, zero Cthulhu. Uh, I've got zero and one Cthulhu. I have one elder. And zero Cthulhu. Wait, That's what she's saying. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have I guess so. <laughs> right, I mean, we've had people say three, so. No, I know. <laughs> I assume if someone says doesn't say much, that it's probably zero. We'll count that. Come on now. Less is more sometimes. I'm going more a little, is also more. I'm going a little insane. I don't okay? trust I said you. more is always more. I'm yeah. going a little insane. Oh, it's me. I have way more to say than you are, so oh. I'm Nick Cage right now. Okay. <laughs> but not the bees. I watched his Lovecraft, his Lovecraft movie. It was weird. Nah. Y'all turn again. Pressure <laughs> um, <Crush yourself. laughs> I don't think I picked a dick yet. I'm going to do a middle card. A middle card? Imagine Ouch. if it's just one round picking each other. There's nobody else. <laughs> this. Yeah. So much. Bring us home, Jay. She's way away. Find an elder berry. That one, yeah. I was saying not the Necronomicon. Let's <laughs> <laughs> be sp- very specific on that one. Yeah, specify. <laughs> yeah, that would be on you. Yeah, you're right. It's all over now. Now if we get the ne- Necronomicon, it's fine. <laughs> Unless there is one card that would make us put this back into the shuffle deck, so. Right. 
don't draw that card either. Unless you're a cultist. Please don't draw from my deck. You do not want that to happen. Unless you do want that to happen, in which case, please draw from my deck. <laughs> Feel free, anytime. Harder to deal when they're all facing different directions. I feel like you could have fixed that before. I could have, but I was trying to save time. But nah. Good news. Mm -hmm. So now it is your turn to go mm -hmm. first over there. Mm -hmm. And reveal what you can get. Hello. Hi, handsome. I have zero and zero. So Lisa, zero Cthulhu, one elder. No, one elder, zero Cthulhu. One elder, no Cthulhu. No, three older and two. Mm -hmm. There you go first. Mm -hmm. Oh, snap. Okay. This one. Please, thank you. Insanity's grasp. If huh? this card is. You can't communicate the rest of Joy. That's fine. So, yeah. Mm. Sounds like communicating to me. Mm. But you do get to draw a card <laughs> from somebody. Yeah, member berries. Member berries. Last <laughs> turn. Uh, I'm going to go with you in the very top. This yeah. Oh, that's third. Oh, snap. Put in. This one? Secretly reveal my role to you. Again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having to show my role to everybody. I have that card every fucking time. Wasn't that dirt last time too? Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you guys sharing secrets? If I get one more, I'm gonna come over here and get nada. Alright, so we shut this back up. Am I done? Can I pull again? That's the rest of the game, Annie Klein. Cursed forever. Just for the round. Which this might be the last round of the game, so. But feel free to continue for the rest of the night. So if anyone wants to, <laughs> oh. if anyone wants to talk shit, now is the time. I mean, I don't wait for a specific time to talk shit. So. I just mean she can't defend herself now. I'm well, still about like, like, I don't care. <laughs> Guys, I thought the we were The tea friends. party was a good thing. No. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh, don't get me started. Triggered. I mean, I am working here. I mean, yeah, no, I'm, just I'm no, enjoying the tax codes here. There you go. You know what you're also doing? Communicate. Fuck you up. Oh, yeah, I gotta mix those up on it. Yeah, I want to be mixed up. I think you're first now, right? Yeah. I think so. How much uh, money you got? One elder, zero Cthulhu. Oh, I got zip and zip. Zero. Uh, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 actually, that might be part of it, though. That might actually be part of it. You might not be allowed to reveal, and that's part of it. But... Well, then I'm revealing Cthulhu. That's fine. That's good. We're going to go with one and zero. Zero and zero. Here you good. No, I mean draw oh. card. One on the on my right, Tyler's left. This one? Yeah. Bazinga. Alright. Touched. Someone talking? What? No. Oh. That's Cody asking if we were down. We go with this guy. Bazinga. Alright, Amy, tell us what you want. Come on, Amy. The silent oh. treatment, really? <laughs> That's communicating joy. That's not okay. <laughs> <laughs> it might be insanity. <laughs> no non-verbals as well. <laughs> um, it's hard to keep up with who that's all. Look at my eyes. I mean, that, that doesn't tell you a lot because which roles are we? <laughs> we don't know. Like. Card and flip it back over. So you get to look at, you get to flip over someone's cards and flip them back over. 
for the table to see where it is. That's their card. For like everybody? Yeah, you just flip it over so we all see it and then it goes back down. <gasps> okay. Gasp. So that tells everyone that that ain't shit. <laughs> so now it's oh. your turn. Mm. Oh, there we go. So the Necronomicon. Four. Now you get to go. Motherfucker! <laughs> God damn it. Final and one all right, J Fred wins the game. Yes. I was happy to win one round. <laughs> I know, I was afraid that J Fred was going to be the cult, which is the only way it really worked out, but. Yeah. I was, <laughs> the second I saw Cthulhu there, I was like, ooh, no one, no one go for any of my cards. <laughs> this is too risky a chance. I did have one sign, but I was like, too risky. What are the odds of grab that one? 33%. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, it was nice to get to try this game out for once. Yeah. It's been sitting on my shelf for years. Maybe just a year. No, a year. He is a little concerned about the time. <laughs> I guess you can have a little book too. <laughs> well, I thought she'd probably stay in the box. Yeah. He's yeah. real handsome. Which one? The oh, the cultist? Real handsome. Yeah. They kind of look like twins. <laughs> yeah, they do. Uh, the other game will be a bit more in depth. This isn't like the monster one from last week, was it? Or last week? Uh, no, there's probably a little more that goes into this one. Okay. <laughs> oh, you did say what? Twenty pages of a rule book? Yeah, it's fun. It's fun to read. Like a bird. Good puck. Stand down. Stand down. <laughs> Stand down. Don't need those for now. So basically, this game—the way the game works—is we're all just explorers exploring this mansion. Okay. Um, at a certain point, the game will change, and a haunting will begin, and one person will turn against the rest of the people. Mm. And there are 50 different scenarios that happen in the game based on where the haunting starts and who starts it. Um, it feels like Kevin in the Woods. Or Clue. Never played. <laughs> no, the, the movie. movie. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, was, I was like, is that a game too? Because I never played it. Who wants the mermaid? Because the mermaid. <laughs> um, as we're going around, we're exploring throughout this, this house and revealing different kind of like floors. Um, so there's an upper floor, a main floor, and a basement floor. I call this one. You was too bad, Tyler. <laughs> I can't just sit there. in the library. Um, you want to just deal with a random character? Yeah. Colonel Mustard. Yes. Once you get one of these, you can choose which side of the character you want. Every character is going to have four stats. Two mental stats, which are knowledge and sanity, and two physical, which are might and speed. Speed is how much you, you walk, and might is kind of like your strength, how much you're going to be able to fight with. Those. Um, so no one got red. Okay. So who's green? Can I trade mine in? Is it a kid? No, it's a matter of which side. Brain. Both sides? What? Mm. You can choose the other Peter now. <laughs> You're better. Ooh, oh, my copies are astrology. It's no, true. That's that's I, cool. I, I like. That's yeah, the new the new edition of the game has these little detailed miniatures. Who's blue? Not me. Madame Zostra. Is that? That's gonna be the Sounds like the one near the You're the purple one? Into yes. the painting. Uh, and you're yellow? Yep. It's like I'm even a little raven claw. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blue. <laughs> Separate those. Stand up more. Also, why is my hobby baseball? Can I carry it back? Because you break gender norms. Because oh. you break gender norms. Because I'm good with that. My birthday is February 14th. Mine's August 2nd. Usually that's when the baby's getting conceived, not born. Mm. Mm. I'm, a, I'm a December baby. December 10th. So the item cards. So close to destinies. September 3rd. But I'm 37 years old, so I don't know how I feel about that. For a second there, I thought we were talking. I forgot we were talking I'm about the game. I was like, there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, the fuck? Don't judge me. I've no, it's not judging me. No, I've aged a lot, okay. That was the thing. It's not because like, there's anything wrong with 37. It's because like, I was like, just the other day you weren't. What are you talking about? <laughs> 
the other day. Derek, we haven't seen you in over a decade. <laughs> 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 That would be accurate, Shane Fred. <laughs> Very accurate. This one kind of looks like a Obi Wan Kenobi, or like a one of the Jedi. Looks like Jinzo from the back. Yeah, Jinzo, most OP of cards in the old days. <laughs> right, like getting yeah, rid of all my trap cool. cards. That's how I win. <laughs> yeah, I rely on those. Who are you? Yours is so cute. I am Heather Granville. Awesome. Missy Du Bois. Is that very nice for her name, like Missy? Yeah. I'll have to grab those. Missy, what's up? These, <laughs> these get clipped onto your character card on pointing at the green number because you slide them down as you increase or lose. Does uh, it become more powerful? Or weaker. No, Once the haunt starts, like there's a skull at the bottom of each one. If any of your skills drop to that skull after the haunt starts, you're dead. I have a game. Oh, well, that's <laughs> super fun. There are other games. <laughs> Acquire some interesting. So that would be playing in corporate conquest. I don't like what these look like coffins. Probably the I didn't even model. put that together, but yeah, <laughs> you're right. It's a sign. So, do we put them on the green number, you said? Yeah, on the green number. Oh, those go. Yeah, should I use the other side? Thank you, Amy. I got you. Oh, they, like, they can clip onto the actual card. Oh, they clip on. Yeah, they, they clip on the slide. Really oh, okay. Silly me. I've already read all of Right now, we'll deal with those. Yeah. And once you read about it, you can't change it. They need to be a little bit longer, though. Because <laughs> they're a little bit enough. far away. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it'd be nicer if they were. But. I guess I can't complain. Like, can I, can I have a half number? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I guess if it bothered you that much, you could, like, trim part of the card and then sit closer. True, right at the edge of the words. Yes. Yeah. I Wait, there's two sides? Yeah, and they have different stats, and it's technically a different character. Just add a little more variety. No, I like Madame Sorcerer. Right. <laughs> so I'm going to use Professor Longfellow. You know that's the back sign. You don't necessarily have to be the child. I don't want to be brand No, they're both they're both oh. the same. They both look the same, kind of as just his are both children. One of them's just Brandon. I mean, who wants that? Come on. Vivian Lopez looks a little unhinged. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think I chose the one that's a little bit more unhinged looking. Yeah. Than mine. <laughs> a little more put together. Oh, See mine. I mean, either one of them look great, but this one looks like mad scientist because he's like bald and no beard. This one, this one at least looks a little more distinguished with his beard. Like he could be a professor he and then like a all of a sudden... This is a scientist. Oh, because he's a priest. Okay, never mind. <laughs> 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 like, oh, Father, uh, you know, actually. He's like, didn't know. Uh, everyone starts here on the entrance hall. What if also, I want to start there? Is there a high requirement? Unfortunately, it doesn't really give you much of a choice. <laughs> what if I want to start in the playground? I wonder if there is a playground. You can hang out with Missy. <laughs> so, I'm going to turn it over to Sly. Missy and you. Play with us. Which one oh, oh, looks like Missy's taller than you. We're not making shiny references this close to October 31st. <laughs> Alright, so when it's your turn, you can do as many of the following actions as you want in any order. You can move. You move up to the number of your speed. Now, if, if at any point a space that you're on requires you to draw a card, um, either an item, omen, or event, you have to stop on that space and can't move anymore. Um, you can discover a new room. That's basically if you're moving off of a doorway, we would flip one over as long as it's the appropriate floor. If not, we would just move it to a discard pile for temporarily. Uh, you can use an item or omen card if you have any. Um, you can attempt a die roll, like if some of the cards say like, oh, to cross over, to go through this door, you have to use a roll of something. Um, or make an attack once the haunt starts, you can start attacking. Um, Basically, the haunt, anytime an omen card is drawn, the one with the raven on it, uh, at the end of your turn, you have to roll six of these die, and you have to roll greater than the number of omen cards that are currently out amongst all of us. If not, that's when the haunt starts, and that's when the game picks up and gets a little more devious. It's when it gets real. As they said. Pretty much, yeah. Um, so pretty much it can't start until there are at least six omen cards if we're rolling six die to determine that. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
How do you get to the basement? Because I only see uh, one set of stairs. So this, this will take you up to the upper landing. The basement, there are other rooms that will cause you to fall to the basement. Okay. Um, okay. There's a coal chute that will shoot you down there. The only way to get back up from the basement... Just to find the um, stairs? So there is a, there's a mystic elevator that can be used. Or there are secret stairs that once they are revealed, um, they lead you back up to the foyer. But, yeah. Fun. Pretty much. Okay. Um, so, I don't really know how it determines who goes first, but I guess we can all just roll a die. And whoever rolls highest, sorry, goes first. I want to use my own die. Did you bring your own die? I did. Oh. Too bad. Because this one has zero, one, and two on it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Woo! Okay, I'll go first. It's loaded. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I just want all the twos, Tyler. All right. So I can move up to three spaces. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You can create a room. I know. I was trying to decide if I wanted to be if I wanted to explore upstairs or not, but no, yeah, I'll go down here and reveal a room. So that one's upper floor, so I can't use that one. This one can be on any floor, so sorry. Sex dungeon. Uh, it's the game room. <laughs> it <laughs> might be a sex dungeon. <laughs> I don't know. That could fit. There are a lot of different rooms game. there, so it is games. Um, so yeah. this one, when I go games. in there, I do have to draw a card. I have to draw an event card. So can you hand me that top one, please? Whoops, you feel a body under your foot before you can leap away from it. You're knocked over. A giggling voice runs away from you. Turn over all your item cards and shuffle them. Player do right randomly. Did, okay, well, I don't have one, so I'll go in the discard pile. How do you accidentally step on a dead body? I don't know, stumbling around, you know? like. I mean, that's, yeah. How is it like a nonchalant thing? <laughs> oh, whoops. <laughs> whoops. <laughs> whoops. <laughs> all right, so that is my turn. George, you're supposed to be in the corner. So now you go, Amy. That's me. I can move three, correct? I am three. Oh, they're clips. <laughs> yeah, I said that. <laughs> Don't worry. Well, yeah, because Amy sign. did the same thing. I and I was like, sign. no, Amy, you can clip them on. Yeah. And that's when I made the comment of they're a little far. So I am going to go the opposite way. So that's a ground room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we may have to end up moving some of those decks. That's fine. Away. Oh, wow. Maybe push it towards the laptop a little a bit. A graveyard already there. When exiting, you must attempt a sanity roll of four plus if you fail. So yeah, right now you have to use an event card. So, so can I have an event, please? Thank you. What the? As you look back the way you came, you see nothing. Ooh. Just empty fog and mist where a room used to be. Well, that's fitting for the graveyard. So pick up the tile for the room you're in after sitting everything on it aside. Put it somewhere else on the same floor of the house so the door is attached to a different unexplored doorway and put back everything you set aside. If there isn't an unexplored doorway on this floor. Oh, so basically you just get to move the graveyard anywhere else you want. But to leave I must roll a knowledge. Yeah, which that will have to be on your next floor. Thank you. The knowledge or something. Knowledge. Yep. No, it says knowledge, yeah. yeah. What if my knowledge well, actually, is higher than that? Not. When exiting, you must attempt a sanity roll of 4+. plus. If you fail, lose one knowledge, but continue moving. Mm. So when you leave, you will have to do a sanity roll for that. And when, whatever the number is when you're doing like those checks, so like, what's your sanity? My sanity is full. So you'll end up rolling four die. Oh, okay. So it's one die for each of these numbers, and then you need to get four or higher amongst all these die to be able to avoid that decrease. That sucks, because there are blanks on those dice. Yeah, there's zero, one, and two on every day. I was about to say, geez, that'd be easy. That's fair. Yeah. All right, start exploring, bud. Little kid. How many can you move? Oh, and also, you if you do, once we do start having items, if you are in the same room as someone, you can trade items with them if you want. Or drop an item, or pick an item up off the ground, if you don't, I don't want it. Uh, so the speed means I can go like four rooms. You can go right. four spaces, yeah. Um, okay. Okay. I see what you mean. So yeah, you can um, if you want to, you can go one, two, three, and go there or upstairs. I don't really feel like going to the graveyard. Yeah, so, it's kind of not sucky. much. Yeah, not much use for that one. I'll just go on over there and reveal the room. This way? Yeah. Okay. So upper ground, basement. That's so that one works. Be good. Okay. Yeah. And position it however you want. 
kind of sucks though because that's kind of tall <laughs> like for and for example like say like if this was a different room if it was right here this is considered a false doorway you can't actually go through it because it doesn't connect and there are Open certain the haunts or abilities that have to do with false doorways and stuff too. Okay. So. Okay. These doors don't go anywhere. Do you want to read? Yeah, it, open. it says just uh, imagine there being like boarded up doors and windows within this haunted house. The instructions say not too hard to imagine, right? Like haunted house have that. Sure. Yeah, so it's an elevator that you can pretty much move anywhere. Oh, the Mystic roll. Elevator? Yeah. yeah, based on what you roll, like it can take you to any of the floors. It's not a bad thing to have. Take me tomorrow. So once per turn, roll two die. And move this room next to any open door on. So you've only moved once of your four spaces, so based on what you roll. So a two. So you go to the ground floor, so it stays. Wow. I mean, I guess you could move it around the ground floor if you wanted to. It's even necessary. So he and could move back? Back out and, and then over to the other one. So two. All right, three. <laughs> the library. Once per game, if you end your turn here, gain one knowledge. Mm -hmm. Is that for each person? Do you want a position like this or like this? Uh, Which way do you want the other doorway going? Flip it. This way? Yeah. Going out this way? Yeah. Okay. To the front of the house. Alright, so you're right there. Now you can still move one more if you want. Oh, well, no, you have to do an event card. Never mind. Well, that means you'll get the, the one knowledge at the end of your turn, though. Webs. Casually reach up to brush some webs aside, but they won't brush away, they clean. And that's a temp they might roll. Four plus. Which you might. Three? Yeah. So you get three die, and you need to beat, get a four or higher? Yeah. Or what? Until someone comes save me. <laughs> like you try it each turn, or? Uh, that's the only thing is like I'm not gonna lie. Game, the descriptions on these cards get pretty long, so that's right with the vibes so of spooky. Any explorer can attempt a might roll to free me. Oh. Okay. Yeah. After three times, if I like, if the, it's a failure every three, every three times, I just disintegrate. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you. So, okay. so basically, it's you're so stuck far here. Away. Yeah. But uh, hey, raise your knowledge. Gain your knowledge, bro. You're a little kid that likes to read, nerd. <laughs> Fucking nerd. What I say is I'm a professor. <laughs> like, I didn't think I won with my hobbies of bugs and basketball, but I guess it does. <laughs> All right, yeah. so you're moved. Yamu. I'm going to go five, three, four. That's going to go right here. That's the ground. That's ground, yeah. Uh, the ballroom. I'm not sure anything kind of all right. Alright, so event. Oh. I have like the scene from Anastasia where all the random folks start jumping in to dance with you. Yeah. Less menacing that way. <laughs> Free me. Please. Free me. <laughs> ah, it's a false doorway, man. She oh. can't get through. So okay. <laughs> so this room is warm. Flesh like walls pulse with a steady heartbeat. Oh. Your own heart beats with the rhythm of the house. You are drawn into the walls oh. and emerge somewhere else. You must draw the next room tile and put it in the house. Put your explorer in that room. So, upper or basement? Uh, yeah, you can go upper or basement. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Where we want to put it? So go to the storeroom and drop an item card. And from there, it'll go to your turn. Can you reveal item cards? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, no, I mean, like, you can lay on face. So, like, it's a cooperative game, so we're all, like, on a side. We it, just can't it, give it to each other unless we're in the same room. Until the haunting yeah. starts. Until the haunting starts, and then one person turns mm -hmm. against everyone else. Joy. There are a couple haunts that have to do with, like, a secret traitor. Like, no one oh, will okay. know who they are. That's cool. Um, but you every haunt has give, different ways. It gives you an extra reroll. Okay. If you don't get what you want. Yeah, and you can use your items once per turn. Cool. Do you keep them? Mm -hmm. Okay. No, yeah, it's like a recurring thing you can use once per turn. Nice. Or use them to trade with other people, stuff like no, that. No, this one says discard this item after you use it. Oh, it does? Oh, okay. Some well, of them will say what Luckily, you know. it tells you what to do. I see. They're very descriptive. Hey, okay, Missy. All right. So I'm going to go here, attempt a might roll to free him. How many die? Three. Three die. Dice keeps 
Oh, you freed him. You freed him. Thank you. Yeah. And you also get to up your knowledge, don't you? Only if I end my turn there. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if I want to do that. Yeah. And you only have to do, like, you wouldn't do an event because that's only the first time someone mm-hmm. enters the room. Uh, uh, go okay. here. Thank you. Cool. Ground floor. Charred room. Yeah. So, like, in this case, we wouldn't have to omen. But that's an omen. Yeah, omen card, please. You fucked us, Jay Ray. Well, I let you go first, so <laughs> you can't be that mad. The mask. Somber mask to hide your intentions. Okay. Once during your turn, you can attempt a sanity roll to use the mask. Four plus, you can put on or take off the mask. If you put on the mask, gain two knowledge and lose two sanity. If you take off the mask, gain two sanity and lose two knowledge. Zero to three, you can't use the mask this turn. Make a haunt roll now. Defense okay, so roll six guy. And you're looking to get one. Just not a zero. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay, well you did good, so <laughs> thank God the hot didn't start this fucking set. <laughs> I'd be stuck forever. <laughs> right? Like we don't know what the I fuck. I still have happening. one more movement left, right? We had to draw an omen card, so oh, I ended okay. your turn. Or I ended your movement at least. And you can always like, still try to use my mask. Eye contact, but he's just not interested in physical contact. Which yeah. one? A little bit on touch. Yeah, eye contact. He's great at eye contact, but nothing else. So is it my turn? Yes. Um, Come on, Professor. Four. He's like, I don't even know how to play this game. What am I doing doesn't. here? Mm-hmm. But that's okay. <laughs> I guess I kind of have to go back up the way I can. Mm-hmm. You could go. Upstairs. I could go to the elevator, I guess, if I want to. It's kind of looks like an alcoholic being next to this drink. Yeah, like, I'll I'll have one, one here to use this room, yeah. so mm-hmm. how many guys? That looks like, like, can I have some, please? Well, mm-hmm. no Could point with that. that. What? Wouldn't that be considered a false doorway? Oh, you're right. Yeah. Never mind. The doorways over no, you here. got me. Yeah, you got me. Thank you. Well, I was thinking you could go on around. But. Yeah, you could go no, around. No, I was trying to just jump through because I didn't say you're right. I mean, I'm saving you spots here. No, yeah, and trust me, like, I'm not going to. I don't want to go, go back there. anymore. Um, go one, two, I'm going to go four. Oh, I'll go with this one right here. Can you hand me that ground floor, please? Uh, the chapel. Once per game, if you end your turn here, gain one sanity. Oh, and I have nice. to end, I have to end my turn there, pretty or movement there, yeah, because of the I need event card, please. Almost fitting. The voice. I'm under the floor, buried under the floor. The voice whispers once, and then it's gone. You must attempt a knowledge roll. Okay. How much knowledge do I have? Five. Okay. Feel okay with this? I hope. Rolls a zero. All right. A six. Uh, so I find something under the floor. Draw an item card. Okay. So. What do I get? Idol. Perhaps it's chosen you for some greater purpose, like human sacrifice. <laughs> Once per turn, you can rub the idol before making any trait, combat, or event roll to add two to the dice roll. Each time you do, lose one sanity. Right. Let's not rub the idol you found in the chapel. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, Under the ground. So my turn ends, I get one more sanity. I feel like that would have been even better if you were using the other character on that card. The, the father, oh, right? I'm in the chat when I find an idol under the fucking floor. Yeah, let's rub <laughs> it once you <laughs> right? like, Rub the idol, lose one sanity. Makes sense that I got it there, though. You can gain one sanity, can use one sanity. Yeah. Or, uh, Amy's turn. Amelia. Excuse me, that is not a new That is only for destiny. Amaretta? My name is like, not sure. Like, Alright, I have sure. to roll a <laughs> sanity. <laughs> Thank you. Most accurate. TM. When exiting, if you or you must attempt a sanity roll of four plus. Okay. So you've got four sanity. So four die. You just need to be four. Or I guess four no pressure. And you did not. Three. Okay. Right. So you can still move out, but you lose one knowledge. Alright, so you got messed up, yeah. I'll go down in knowledge. And I'll move out of there. Mm-hmm. Let me 
Now this is interesting because knowledge doesn't go one, two, three. No, four. like all the stats are, are going to have like doubles and stuff on them too. All right. And so I'll go. the top three I have are six. So. Okay. <laughs> Into the game room, I can continue moving, knowledge right? Knowledge goes up to eight. I have three. One. Understanding. Six, 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 sanity. Two. I'm going to go with you secretly insane. Pretty, pretty insane. And I'm going to stop in the bull room. Let me draw an event. No, you would only get the event the first time someone goes into it. Oh, okay, perfect. So I'll stop, stop in the bull room. <laughs> I'm going to chill there. I don't want yeah, anything to happen. Right. <laughs> Sounds good to me. All right, Billy the Kid. Peter the Kid's there. We're going back in the webs. You want what? Back in the webs. <laughs> we jump just back in. Out of there. <laughs> Dive. I don't know the life outside the webs anymore. <laughs> now I know. I guess I'll go this way. Yeah, towards Jay Fred. Okay, one. Uh, until my left. Two. Cool. Yeah. Position that how you want to position it. The conservatory. I'm gonna go with the only entry. Ah, <laughs> oh, never mind. Okay. And take an event card. The lost one. Oh no. The woman wearing a Civil War dress beckons to you. You fall into a trance. Mm -hmm. I've been some fucked cards. <laughs> <laughs> you must attempt a knowledge roll. If the result is five or more, you break out of your trance and gain one knowledge. Otherwise, roll three dice to see where the lost one leads you. Alright, well, let's try this knowledge roll first. How many do you need? Five. Okay, that's good. You're smart, kid. Nerd. You, you did learn something in that library after me. Alright, so, yep. yeah, you got plenty. You got seven. <laughs> so, so, what happens now? Uh, I gain one knowledge. Oh, okay. You survived the woman. You're like, nah, bitch, like, leave. Sorry. Flashlight. I know better. Your war is over. Leave. Mm. No, mm. that's where if I had lost it. Right there. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and head out of the circle. We well, had to draw an event, so that'd be the end of your turn. Oh, okay, then I'm good. Okay. I'm gonna draw under there. You, you can take this up or one. Yeah, she gets killed. Mm -hmm. All right, and take the bedroom. And any bed. She jumps out the window. I went to the bedroom <laughs> already. All right. The question is, why did you go to the bedroom? Really? I mean, there's some good reasons to go to the bedroom. <laughs> but is does this it, one of those good reasons? Does it give you might? Or steed? Or steed? Why to freedom? These miniatures Each need explorer work. in the garden, <laughs> graveyard, tower, on the balcony, or in a room with an outside facing window. So what do you have to do? Uh, <laughs> Jump out. <laughs> Linda must attempt a sanity roll. You back away from the ledge if I get three plus, or I jump to the patio. If it isn't in the house, search the room. Stack for it. Oh, okay, I see what it's saying. Okay. Okay, so you do a sanity roll, so three die. Good luck. It gets that better. Uh, get three or more. I thought two. I thought I was a lot on sanity roll. Right. Yeah, she's she's like I got this. <laughs> I back away from the ledge. I don't need to jump. Mm -hmm. Life is That's worth good. <laughs> it's not that crazy apparently. Yeah. All right, Dick Plus, if you needed to, I mean, if you really needed to, you could have done the lucky stone. Well, uh, that would have to. Get I think rid you'd of have it. to get rid of it. Yeah, it might not well. be worth it if it's just for that. <laughs> and my turn there. You gain yourself a little sanity. Yep. Nice, nice. Like it. Usually it takes other people. I'm leaving. <laughs> but an event. Luckily, J. Fred, I'm not no, the priest in there with you. You're you not. Right. <laughs> Sorry. You are a child. True. <laughs> but I'm a female child. So. You're right. Tyler's more my prey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> you heard what I said. what I said, okay? So does that mean that the cobwebs in the, in the library? No, it was just that one time. Okay, thing. that's nice. Um, Those are for me, Amy. <laughs> I, was, I was trapped, okay? <laughs> One. At least the crazy two. around. Can you hand me? Can you, can you find a ground floor? There we go. Thank you. 
Dusty hallway. House is getting bigger. <laughs> Dang. Alright, so that was two movement. So I'm going to go ahead and just hop back over here. Go her. Not that one. That one will work. Ah, oh, motherfucker. Cole, shoot. I slide down to the basement landing. So that's three and then four. Would you would you count that a fall because you fell? It does count as one. In the rule book, it says that it will count as oh. a one movement. So basically, if I was already at three right here, I couldn't go here because I technically need two movement to do that. Oh. But if you uncover it and so you would just uncover it and put it there, and you can't move there. Can we consult with it's the rule book? Special yeah, round with cold shoot. When you enter this tile. You move immediately to the basement landing, entering the coal chute and sliding to the basement count. Oh, it counts as one together. Never mind. Right. Okay. I had misread that. Yeah. That, that makes more sense. That was a good idea. That was. So that counts as three then, and You're I can still move one, one more. You're the first one in there, right? Mm -hmm. mm, so you I can actually take that basement one that was right there. That's fine. Thank you. Yeah, Appreciate it. Needs two. Of, oh, the stairs from the basement. That's convenient. <laughs> Lay down, buddy. So. Cool. We can now get out of the basement and go to the foyer if we need to. Woo -woo. Thank you for that. And that is the end of my turn. <laughs> so it's back to me. Yep. Let's go. Okay. I guess I will do Speed three. Do I want to continue exploring or do I want to try and up some things? You come to the basement. <laughs> She's like, no. <laughs> sounds dangerous. I wouldn't trust it. Yeah, sounds dangerous. And he's the only one down there, sounds dangerous. True. You're not my prey, okay? I don't know. You have a prey that makes it I seem have not. <laughs> Also, don't, don't squint your eyes at me. <laughs> Targeting. <laughs> oh, okay, as this, this is a cooperative. Oh, does that perk up your attention, huh, Luke? The alcohol? <laughs> He's like, now I'm awake. He's like, I don't like that sweet and sour. I'm going to sniff the alcohol more. So, uh, as this is a cooperative game and we're trying to be one together until such a time when nice. <laughs> we're fucked. Um, Why, Why did you have to elaborate on that? I am going to consult <laughs> with the group. Sucks. Should I go to the chapel and increase... Because I get to increase what my... What is your sanity? Four. That's not bad. Is that like your second from bottom... I mean, the last th two. She are has four, four. She started right here, and she has two more fours below. Mm -hmm. Or I can go up to five. Mm -hmm. Or I can continue exploring. You can really go either way. It's up to you. Yeah, pretty much. No. Um, I'm about I will say that once the haunting way. starts, from if I understand that correctly, we're going to want these to be higher, so that they don't. You fall just have a higher chance of survival. Yeah. Right. I mean, you only take, like, you only decrease them if a card makes you decrease them or if you end up taking, like, damage from a fight. Um, but yeah, it's, they don't, like, decrease, like, one per turn or anything like that. Well, I don't have much speed to go on anyway at the moment, so I'm going to go ahead and go into the chapel. I'll increase my sanity up to five. And then I'll end my turn there because. Yeah, there wasn't much else to. Oh, I well, I'm paid. <laughs> In the fucking conservatory where there's nothing there. <laughs> I'm paying her. I'm gonna go out. You sure? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'll just think there's no other way to go. Like, if this is the entrance, <laughs> does, does this do? mean the, this we can't is the front put, door? We can, this is a fault. Yeah, we no, can't put anything. Okay. So we have more. Uh, you can go up. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna creep right in this baby. Go. Yeah. Two. Off the basement. Ground floor, baby. Oh, cool. The cloth room. Oh, oh, that's actually one of the special ones. Maybe he shouldn't explore anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Only the explorer who first discovers the collapse room needs to make the speed roll printed on the tile. Thereafter, an explorer that enters the room can either ignore the room's ability or use it intentionally to get to the basement. So you're about to fall to the basement. That's what it sounds to like. a speed roll. A five plus. Which seems unlikely. <laughs> What's your speed? Four die. Four die. <laughs> It's unlikely. So then you fall to the basement. Basement it is. Draw a basement tile and put it into play. You, you fall there and take one die. Right oh, and you take one die of physical damage. And I found a chasm. That's another so special. Physical card. damage would that be nice? So physical. Basically, he's gonna roll this, and 
whatever he rolls on it, he can he can split it between might or sp and speed, or he can put it however he wants between those oh, two. Okay. So the might and speed are your physical, so he can do one of each or one of them two. I'll go one might to stay at three. No one speed. Yeah. Oh, chasm. Actually, I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> where, do you, where do you want the Where do you want the chasm at down here in the basement? Which of these three? Mm. You want it. You're right. <laughs> just... I think the chasm is a barrier room. Yeah. So basically, like when you enter a barrier room, let's say you're like in here. You can choose to fall on which side, Tyler. Do you want to be on this side of it or this side? Because you actually have to make a roll to be able to cross this room. You want to be on this side or this? Let me go with that side. This side? Yeah. Okay, so that's where you fell. Cool. You would say a speed roll of three plus to cross. Yeah, if you fail, you stop moving. Hmm. All right, guys, I'm never crossing, just so you know. <laughs> He's like, I'm staying on this side of the basement. This is my home <laughs> right now. I'm hoping there's another set of stairs over there. You guys do what you do. If he ends up being the possessed one, then we're pretty lucky. Just sure. stay over there. Oh no, I'll come after you guys. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'll you. cross I <laughs> will fall so only for this. For that reason, I will come. I will cross the castle. Alright, I'd say it's your turn. Let's say it. Okay, there you go. In the balcony. Ooh, don't mm -hmm. trust it. Don't trust anything. Are you staying there? Yeah. Omen. 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 I think I'll die. We've got two omens. Uh, Madman. Companion. Oh, you made a friend. Uh, <laughs> gain two might and lose one sanity now. Well, my friend's a madman. But also very real damage. <laughs> lose to my and gain one sanity if you lose custody of the madman. Okay. This only can't be dropped, traded, or stolen. Make a haunt roll now. Oh, well, thank God. Yeah, we're safe. Where are we? Fringe. The first one I saw was that blank, and I was like, no. <laughs> right? Like, don't, 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 don't. Um. Very good, very good. Oh, no, he's got, I know he's got the bell. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Beefy hallway. <laughs> good. Stay. Yeah. This is kind of a sad place for this. What a waste. One way to go. <laughs> what a waste. Yeah. Patio and an event card. At least it doesn't move like the graveyard. <laughs> they really need to work on making this house. Spider. Open. <laughs> a spider the size of a fist lands on your shoulder and crawls okay. into your hair. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but she has hands. Yeah, you're a little girl right now, bro. Yeah, right now. You must attempt a speed roll to brush it away or a sanity roll to stand still. Four plus it's gone. Gain one to the trait you use to attempt this roll. One to three, it bites you. Take one die of physical damage. Zero, it takes a chunk out of you. Take two dice of physical damage. From somewhere Good. in the... Yeah. Yeah. Physical yeah. damage, just you said off. speed or sanity? Yeah, I'm going to go with speed. From a little girl voice. Yep, that'll do it. Yeah. So you get one more speed now. Yeah. Quick little motherfucker. Dual speed. Yeah, six. I mean, I'm um, nine. So, you know, quick little kids. Oh, I was like, nine? I don't think to go that high. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm nine. <laughs> yeah, that's all that. Are we talking like German nine, or are we talking like <laughs> the number nine? Nine. <laughs> Yeah, I question. Right. So, here we go. One here. We're going to take this basement tile. You want to join me across the chasm? I do not. Uh, this is the crypt. The crypt or the crypt? Crypt. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, if you end your turn here, take one point of the mental damage. I think the crypt was one of these rooms, though, right? Or maybe it wasn't. That was one of the special rooms. Oh, the vault is. Okay. Okay, cool. 
for your special lines. Crit. If you end your turn here, just take one point of mental damage. Well, I kind of fucking have to end my turn there. It's not fair. I have to have any event cards later. <laughs> well, Before making a roll, okay. Uh, something slimy. What's around your ankle? A bug? A tentacle? A dead hand clawing? I must attempt a <laughs> speed roll. What's my speed? Four? Pulling up his Um. Four plus, you break you break free and gain one speed. One to three, lose a might. Zero, lose a might and a speed. What's my sanity though? Do I have sanity to give? Uh, okay. I'm gonna take the risk, I guess. Yeah. What's the worst thing that can happen? You do. I can lose a might and a speed. I got a four. Okay, so I gain one speed. Yes. It's like where the other die go? How'd you get four? I only see two. <laughs> Forward. Two and two. Alright, I am done with that. But now, because I'm ending my turn in there, I take a point of mental damage, and we'll just knock my knowledge back down from five to five. Five to five. That is my turn. Okay, so that is back to me. I can move three. I'm probably going to move straight up through the dusty hallway. One, two, three. So you're gonna stay on this side of the basement. Okay, what did I get? It's a lot of basement cards. Oh no, no man. Uh, junk room. Uh, when exiting you must attempt a might roll of three. If you fall, lose one speed. But continue moving. God, I'm really sucky at killing cards. But I have an omen card, so what do I get? You can do it. Drop his fucking head off. Holy symbol. A symbol of calm in an unsettling world. Gain two sanity now. Lose two sanity if you lose the holy symbol. So I go six, seven on my sanity. Make a haunt roll. So you need greater than three. Yeah. How many? Six? Six die. No 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 Two. No, 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 no. So three other two. Yeah. Yeah. All right, thanks, guys. <laughs> I am very sane and very safe until I lose this card. All right, uh, Tyler's turn. Hey, Quinn. Oh, okay. <laughs> you cross it back over. Or you explore. No exploring. <laughs> All right, take one of those basement. Gotta get through these basement cards somehow. It's true. Pentagram chamber. Oh. Hold it, stop. <laughs> well. Jeez. There's an omen card, and when exiting, you must attempt a knowledge roll of 4 plus. If you fail, lose one sanity. Oh, there's only one way to go on that one, okay. So the chasm leads to the pentagram chamber. Good to know. A girl, companion. A girl, trapped, alone. You free her. Gain one sanity and one knowledge now. I'm gonna lose it if I lose the girl. Does it say that? Yes. All the omens, or all the companion ones are, probably most of the omens are probably like that. If you lose it, you lose the benefit too. Well, it's not terrible, considering no. it's an omen. Especially for some of those, like the girl, I think is the same as the madman. It can't my, be stolen or traded. Also my first girlfriend, you can't just lose her. <laughs> That's right, he's a little kid, dude. True. He's yeah. like, damn, I found a girl up in this chamber, let's, let's do this. Alright, right, uh, stuck in this chamber for a while. Now. So now you have to get greater than a four. Okay. Well, I guess you have to get four or more, I think. No. No, you'd have to get greater than four. Two, four. Four. Mm -hmm. Let me consult. Let me consult <laughs> with, with the haunt. <laughs> We're not missing. Haunt this. roll was what, 17? 15. Taking a haunt roll, you must roll six dice to you draw a card of the haunt roll if you roll less than the total number. Okay, so. Equal to safe then, okay. Alright, so I didn't need to cheat by making that a five. <laughs> no, you did not need to cheat to make that a five. Do you do your uh, knowledge roll? He hasn't exited. Oh. So I'll have to wait till his next turn to exit the room. Okay. And so I do the only card my turn's over, right? Yeah. Okay. You know what sucks? It's like you have to roll to exit the room and then you have to roll again to go across <laughs> the chasm. Oh, I'm not leaving the room. You're like, I'm <laughs> staying in this chamber forever. Me and the girl are just gonna live here forever. <laughs> I mean, she's been there for a while, I'm sure. We go one, two, go over there. Oh, right. Basement. 
Basement. Basement. Nope. Basement and ground. Yeah. Like the really upper floor. We're in the upper floor. Right? Wait, I think there was. Oh, ah. ah, there was. Aha. I think I stuck together. Vault. Oh, that was a special room. Attempt a knowledge roll of six plus to open and empty the vault. It has two item cards and an attack <coughs> card. Knowledge. This is the place to be. A tower card. Dude, I should have a serious right stand right fuck basement. True. Yeah. I don't know why I thought the basement would be a jolly time. Okay. Five die for her knowledge room. So. What do I need to get? <laughs> um. You can attempt a knowledge six roll plus. of six plus to open the vault. <laughs> so, if it doesn't get opened, can you oh, continue yes, trying? Yeah, on your next turn you can try again to open it. But oh, it also, lucky stone it too. looks like it's also an event. Yeah, so she'll ha she will have to pull an event, pull an event card. Yeah. Okay. For every time? Mm. No. Just when the room is first discovered, but in that room, whoever's in there can attempt okay. to open the vault. Okay. I'm gonna use this and roll again. Right. Item cards. What? Item cards discard, not the event card discard. Oh yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Closer. Yeah. <laughs> Still no. Take your event card. Just like no. I don't think I want to. <laughs> Something hidden. It. There's something odd about this room, but what? It's tickling the back of your mind. If you want to try and figure out what's odd, attempt a knowledge roll. Uh, Do you want to attempt? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I mean, you can on the wall, card. slides away, revealing an alcove, draw an item card. Or I just lose sanity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try a knowledge roll as well. There yeah. you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey. So, um, an yeah. Yeah, item card? Uh, yeah, throw an item card. Well, you might not get what's in the vault, but at least you get something. <laughs> you find something outside the vault. Heal yourself. Something that tickles work. at the back of your mind. <laughs> mm, I need a right. need a ground floor. Or... This house is getting big. Well, the basement's kind of leading to a lot of dead ends. I mean, yeah, oh, true. That's cool. And then the ground floor has a lot of hallway so, space. Kitchen. Oh, at least there's a kitchen. And then we'll make a card. Dog companion. This mangy dog seems friendly. At least you hope it is. Gain one might and one sanity now. Lose one might and one sanity if you lose custody of the dog. Take a small monster token to represent the dog. Put it in your room. Use a token of a different color from other monsters, if any. Once during your turn, the dog can move to an unexplored room up to six spaces away using doors and stairs and then return. It can pick up, carry, and or drop one item before it returns. Oh dog my. isn't slowed by opponents. It can't use one-way passages or rooms that require a roll. It can't carry items at slow movement. This omen can't be dropped, traded, or stolen. Make a hot roll. That sounds kind of like it turned into Cujo. Not sure. <laughs> oh. I think certain haunts use it. Mm, okay. It's like a turn five counter. Is that? Oh, what? Five. How many do we have? Three, I think four, five. 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 Okay. So we six. Oh, a... oh yes. that's a one. Oh. So six. I think. Yeah. Oh, so we're good then. Yeah. yeah. All right. Very good. So my turn. Yeah. I'm trying. Right. Don't put it up. One. There's one over the window down here. I do have to draw a nomen card. Catacombs. You ruined us. Is it a one way? No, I think it's one of the barrier rooms too. I don't like that some of these are like special rooms that you have to have on here. 
Yeah, it's a better area. Okay. So, come into it. You can attempt a sanity roll of six plus six plus to cross if you fail to stop moving. And then I have to stop moving already because I have to get an omen card. Crystal Ball. Peace images appear in the glass. Once during your turn, after the haunt is revealed, you can attempt a knowledge roll to appear into the crystal ball. Okay, so I can I hold that for now. Okay, so make a haunt roll. Cool. Yikes. So now how many haunts are out? Six? Six at least. So that's the you get six or more. Okay, I did that. Okay. We survived. Yep. So now it's your turn, Amy. My turn. I have to roll to get out, don't I? When oh, exiting, yeah. you must attempt a might roll of three plus. So I have four might. I have to roll four die. Four die. Any three mm -hmm. or more. I mean, either way you move out, Fail. you just lose a speed if you don't. You lose one speed. She made it. I made it. Tonight. The first round that doesn't give me a nothing. Alright, so I am going to go this way. So I've got a ground floor. Wow, great. An omen. <laughs> An abandoned room. Can I like bypass it or mm -hmm. do I have to stop? You have to stop. And now you, you have, have to, to get, get now you have to get seven or more on this roll. Ooh. Spirit board. A board with letters. Okay, okay no, I'll put them back. I don't mess with these <laughs> boards. Um, a board with letters and numbers to call the dead. Before you move during your turn, you can look at the top tile of the room stack. If you use the spirit board after the haunt has been revealed, the trader can move any number of monster, monster one space closer to you. If you are the traitor, you don't have to move those monsters. If there is no traitor, all monsters move one space closer to you. Make a uh -huh. hot roll. So it doesn't affect anything until we start getting haunted, right? I mean, you Actually, can, during your turn, like before you move, you can look at the top tile of the room. Unlike what you did and split them up. Oh, that's not a good sign. We need six amongst these other two. Right. You need three twos. Perfect roll. That's yeah, okay, so the haunt's gonna start. So is that a spirit guys. board in the abandoned room? You were really good. Sorry guys. No, no way we're so, black. Look, yeah. I'm, I'm not the one on the The spirit board in the abandoned room, right? Mm-hmm. Haunt number forty-eight. Oh, what did we pick? So it tells us where's where's forty eight? Forty eight. The left you're the haunt revealer, so the left of you is the traitor. Hi. So now it's the kid, he's stuck in the basement, he's a bit far away. The it, the yeah. haunt is gonna be called stop, stacked like cordwood. So what happens now is you go into another room and read the details of this page. Okay. We have our own goals and this one that we all read together. Because okay. now you're against us. Okay. And I'll tell you what you have to do to win and what your goals are and stuff. Can we Obviously, he shouldn't be telling us what he has. No. has. And can we tell him what we have to do? It's, yeah. it's probably more beneficial that we don't. Okay, that's fine. Sorry. Bye, Tyler. Bye. Uh, Hope you find your dead sister or something. Yeah, you did this. <laughs> 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 right. I mean, technically, you're the one who was in the pentagram chamber. So. <laughs> With the girl, might I add. I'm learning about a new religion. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Stacked like cordwood. While you were driving to this mansion, one of your companions spoke of a series of grisly deaths that took place here five years ago. A group of teenagers had sneaked away from the safety of their summer camp to explore the house on the hill. They hoped for an amorous interlude until a madman slaughtered them one by one. Your companion told you that the murderer couldn't be killed and that his mangled body always returns to kill again. Now, one of you has seen the madman's picture hanging in the hallway. Judging from the portrait, he looks like he could be a relative of one of your companions, the one who told you the story. Peering through a doorway, you see your traitorous companion standing in a room with bodies stacked like cordwood. Uh, and then you hear someone or something walk through the front door. So right now, set aside 
a number of triangular micro-roll tokens equal to the number of players. Set aside an equal number of triangular non-roll tokens. So we need might and non-roll tokens. Five of each. These tokens aren't organized, I apologize. So what am I looking for? Uh, that's a good question. Okay. Uh, I might have to look. Might and knowledge roll tokens, but... Yeah. What they are, we don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of trying to look through and see if I can notice. Maybe if there's... Oh, uh, they're going to be little triangles, yeah. So that's a might. I got one might. I don't have any. I think I've just got monster tiles. It's a might. It's not another one. There's a might. What did it say? What was the other one? Knowledge. Knowledge. Okay, so not that one. Sorry, Amy. I'm fine. I'm just trying to help. No, here you go. Take a second. Looking for knowledge? Knowledge and might. I got one knowledge. So get another knowledge. We need one more might. I have nothing. Items, sanity. There's a knowledge and a might. There's the last might. We need one more knowledge and... Do you want me to split up some of these so that at least we've got them? Um, you don't have to right now. I mean, you can if you want. Obviously, you don't necessarily have to right now because at some point I will just need to go through this and do that. A little berry. I don't have knowledge on this one. I have another knowledge one. I don't have one. I don't see I think that there should have been six of each one I would have thought. Well, if it's asking for it, you would have full. Equal to the total number, to equal to the number of players. Um, set aside an equal number oh. of triangular knowledge world tokens. Is there any other thing? You want me to call down on the screen? Hmm. On the divider? Um. Yep, look at you. There we go. Thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, no, not yet. Okay. Are you guys going to come get me one again? Yeah, yeah. Well, I'll come get you. No, we're just going to keep playing without you. <laughs> <laughs> right. All right, video games in here. We're just, we're just going to win the game when you can't stop us. Well, you're still stuck in the pencil. All right. All right, I guess we're going to like put all these away now. Right, so well... Yeah, why don't you read the rest of it? Well, yeah, because we might need to put some of these, I'm sure, down at some point. So at least if we've got them. No, it doesn't. I'm reading through it. Doesn't look like, well, curse weapon. Well, whatever your choice. Of heroes don't have curse weapon. Also. We are reading ours. What about titles? Well, that's true too. I'll let him look through the shit if he needs it though. It sounds like a him. Probably. At least let's okay, split yeah. up the S's. I'll set that over there for you. Yeah. Thanks. Alright, um, so we set aside five of each of those. What do you know about the bad guys? The traitor is working with Crimson Jack, a supernatural serial killer. Jack can be permanently killed only with a cursed weapon hidden in the house. If you defeat him any other way, he will return stronger than ever. You win when you find the cursed weapon and use it to kill Crimson Jack. How to find the cursed weapon? You know there's a cursed weapon in the house. The axe, the spear, the blood dagger, or the sacrificial dagger. Our choice. Are there tokens for that? For what? Uh, for maybe. Probably. Um, Either that or they might be. It might be an item card, though, too. Oh, yeah, maybe. Yeah. If the heroes don't have the cursed weapon, they must search for it. It's located in one of the following rooms. The library, the chapel, the vault, or the attic. Once during your turn, you can attempt a knowledge roll of 3 plus in any of these rooms to find it. The vault must be open. Huh, so where I'm at. Oh, if we're doing the vault. The other rooms, it doesn't matter. If you succeed, search through the appropriate stack for a cursed weapon of your choice, take it, and shuffle that stack. So it's probably an item. Could be an omen, I guess. But, uh, the heroes must then figure out how to use the cursed weapon against Crimson Jack. If you are in the same room as the cursed weapon, you can attempt a might roll or knowledge roll of 5 plus to study it. If you succeed, put a might roll or knowledge roll token, depending on the trait used, on your character card. When the heroes have collected a number of those tokens equal to the number of players, they can understand how the cursed weapon can be used to kill Crimson Jack. Uh, therefore, after if any hero defeats Crimson Jack using the cursed weapon, Crimson Jack is killed permanently. You must do this. At the beginning of your turn, Crimson Jack exudes an aura of fear. If you're in the same room as Crimson Jack, you must succeed on a sanity roll of 3 plus 
or lose one point from a mental trait and one point from a physical trait. And then there's a little thing to read if we win. So basically, we need to go to the library, chapel, vault, or attic. So library and chapel are probably the two best ones. Um, so I mean, you can try to open the vault again because you're already right there. Yeah. But, um, and so we need to do a knowledge roll of three plus there to find the weapon. And then we would search for it in the stack and get it. The library is the most strategic place to be because then if you miss it, you get another knowledge just for ending your time. That's true. So and the chapel is true to so it's whichever one. But um, it's knowledge or might. Right? You're right, like we need might or knowledge. So knowledge, you're right, the library is the best one. Um, you can attempt a might roll. Once we have it, yeah, we just need to, amongst all of us, accumulate five of one of those. You succeed, put a might or knowledge roll. When the heroes have collected a number of those tokens equal to, oh, so you can do either one, just five amongst these, amongst all of us. And we then can... whoever has that item has to be the one to kill them. And we can give items as long well as Yeah, if we're in the same room, we can trade items okay. if we need to. Um, so like honestly, at this point, it's probably best for all of us to kind of group up at the library and stay as a group. Um, when you were in those tokens out there, or maybe it'll probably tell Tyler have, what kind of token he'll need. I have split them up. All these are little the S's, all those with the round ones. And were any of these Crimson Jake? Yep, right there. Perfect. So Tyler will probably need that one. We'll leave that right there for him. And anything else he needs, he can get yeah. from there. I, you can probably stick it on top of that. Or, or, right, or just leave it right there. Leave it right there for us. So what did it say happens if you're in the same room as the... So, if you're in the same... Uh, where did it say? You that? feel oh. chill? At the, beginning, at the beginning of your turn, a Crimson Jack... Yeah, at our, of our turn, Crimson Jack exudes an aura of fear. If he's in the same room as us, then we have to... At the beginning of our turn, then we have to succeed on a sanity roll of three or more, or we lose a mental and physical so basically, you don't want to start your room in the same place. Cool. Are we good? Everyone, yeah, yes. not so we chapel, can library. Yeah, just ask for the book that way he doesn't know what we're trying to do. Um, library, chapel, vault, and we haven't found the attic, so. Everyone good? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is From number 48. Stay there, keep rolling. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that works. How, how or is if it you want to come down and join us, it's up to you. How is it that we earn these? Uh, if you're in one of those rooms, you have to do a sanity of three, or no, knowledge of three plus. Okay. 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 Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we have to find, yeah, we have to find the item first. Okay. Okay. So that's... Where Where is the item? Then apparently you can find it if you go in the vault. Okay. Yeah, so vault, chapel, order, library. Mm-hmm. All places. Okay. He just opens the door and all four of us just start stabbing. <laughs> <laughs> so we're not sure exactly what you needed, so we've split up the tokens here yeah, in case it tells you what you need to, to make it up. a little easier because originally they were just kind of piled on top of each other. But we also pulled that one in the event that you needed. But it is important to note that otherwise, like the game does continue, like we can still explore new rooms, you know, events and stuff can still activate. We can still get omen cards, but we won't have to roll for the hunt anymore because the hunt's already started. Nope. We start at the entrance. Yeah. Okay. Um, play just kind of continues. I don't remember who. Oh, you did that, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, no. It says once the hunt starts, it always starts with the player at the left of the uh, trader. All right. So, do I need to roll for that? Or just stay there? Uh, okay. To get in the vault. Uh, you can attempt a knowledge roll of six plus to open and empty the vault. Okay. How many knowledge do you have? Five. Five. So you need six plus? Yeah. yeah. No big deal. No pressure. <laughs> you know, if you split them up, I find it easier to do three and three because then it's not like six going everywhere. Well. Wow. I'm gonna go with so you already six. can't get in, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> second time wasn't bad though. <laughs> well, it's a good effort. So the first part has gone better. Yeah. And that's ending your time there, uh, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. I do think it's cool that it has like 50 different scenarios to go through though. Yeah. Very replaceable. Yeah, that's really cool, yeah. Yeah, yeah. instead of having the exact same email. Yeah. And, and the fact that the house can be laid out everything hey, uh, black and white. What, what's that say? Huh? What's it say? What's what's it say? <laughs> It's like, what do you mean, his shirt? Are you trying to get him to reveal something? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that one. Oh. 
Was this a timer or was it a lot page? Was this good? It's not you have a book, isn't it? In the book. <laughs> right. Don't we all have the same book? Right. No, we don't all have the same book. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you were asking. Yes, that's exactly right. Bullshit. This is discrimination against us. If you were here, Tyler, it says uh, Secrets of Survival. Do not read. Hmm. Traitor's tone. It says do not read until the hot mayor begins. Mm -hmm. Alright, so now it's Jacob. Does he have to keep rolling to go across these as he's the traitor now? So in the rule book, if I remember correctly, it says that you actually don't have to suffer the negative stuff. That would become a self rule. Yeah, there's a there's a section here I'll let you read uh, over the. I'm not helping you. The, if you want to read this section, the traitor's new powers right there. <laughs> Ground. Hmm. Also, if you're moving past an opponent, for example, if Tyler okay. was in a room and we want to move through the room he's in, Guarded. like like this, for example, I, it would take one to move here, but then it takes mm -hmm. two to move out of that room because he's in it. Damn straight. Smoke, smoke billows around you. You cough wiping away tears. With the smoke token in this room, the smoke blocks line of sight from adjacent rooms. The explorer rolls two fewer dice, minimum of one die, okay. on, all traits, on all trait rolls while in this room. Smoke. So what happened? <laughs> uh, basically, you just can't see adjacent rooms while you're in that room, and you roll one fewer die if you have to roll anything while you're in that room. Mm -hmm. Is that it? Are you gonna, card, so I guess I oh, yeah, that's right are here. you gonna take your pet with you, or are you gonna just leave him? Then to say, if you wanted to, you could send him six rings away. Yeah. Did. Can I still do that now, or? Yeah, like your turn doesn't have to end when you draw the card. It just means you can't move anymore. So can I explore that room? Mm-hmm. I don't see why you would. Yeah, as long as we can get a ground floor card out here. Well, we, at least we've almost got the entire ground floor covered. Statuary <laughs> corridor and another event card. <laughs> yeah, the place just keeps on going. <laughs> That's an interesting dynamic to the house, though. Right? Like, you think about where everything's laid out, and you're like, this is very confusing and not <laughs> at all. I would, not buy, I would not buy this house. <laughs> 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 Mother and child still embracing. Put the skeleton's token in this room. <laughs> Take one die of mental damage. That's right, bitch. But but once during an explorer's turn, that explorer can attempt a sanity roll to search the skeletons. Mm -hmm. Five plus draw an item card, remove the skeleton's token. Zero to four, to? you dig around but find nothing. Take There's one die of mental okay. damage. Each result affects only the explorer making that roll. I have a skeleton to There we go. Oh, you found it? Skeletons. Skeletons. So anyone who goes in there loses a might or a sanity? Do we have to like or is it just that one time? Should we keep them out? I think it's just the Take one time. Take one die. Oh, so one a mental damage. Yeah. Once during the explorer's turn, the explorer can attempt a sanity roll to search the skeleton. Search the skeleton. Uh, but it's your animal, so I don't think it, it affects your animal, does it? No, it shouldn't affect the animal, I don't think. Okay. Because it's Unless, not you. I mean, yeah, whatever the companion thing says. But if not, then yeah, I would wear it. I, just, I would just assume then that the dog also probably can't search the bodies. Yeah. Yeah. It's just if it were an item room, it could pick up the one item. What's this for? Well, that's a turn counter that certain haunts, I think, use. Okay. I like if there's like, because I'm sure there are some that are like countdowns. Oh. So since my dog what encountered an event it? card, is that done for him, or can he continue moving? What does it say on? It doesn't. It says. Take this one off. Put it around. Once during your turn, the dog can move to any. <laughs> any unexplored room. room, so that would be one room. So since he went to one unexplored room. Yeah, then that would be the end of it. Okay, go. My turn. No, I'm Don't forget you're stuck with whatever's going on here. Well, only if I want to cross. Okay. I, mean, I can still go backwards. Um, if you go up, where does it leave you? Four, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna 
do a knowledge roll. Right? Yeah. Oh, it was? Oh, it was. I wish you could do music no, on Twitch because I would turn on the music for this particular killer. So my knowledge is what? Five? I need a three You just plus. sit in the back and you do your own music. Can you hand me the item pile, please? The oh, pile? The yeah. pile. Like the pile pile? Pile pile. No, the pile pile. Oh, right, okay. Easy mistake. Yeah, I, I understand. Like a pile of wood? Or a cord? What? Those are this haunting that cord <laughs> in the name. Yeah, that's that's uh, what I was going for. So I know, that's, that's why I looked at you like Yep. Mm -hmm. That guy kind of looks. Kind of like one of the characters that was on Metalocalypse, whatever. Metalocalypse, mm -hmm. yeah, it does. Got kind of stringy hair, sunken features. Okay, or that's the last one. Maybe it's, uh, can you hear me the Omen deck? Damn, bro. I'm trying to see where I want to get prices. Like a social security card too? Mm -hmm. oh, if you're offering. <laughs> Just saying, there's an only over there. Okay, I'm gonna take this card, the spear. Stuff will leave that. Intense eye contact. We can give him a card if he wants. He can be the crazy dude. You wanna be a crazy dude? He <laughs> does look like a crazy dude. I think Brian will be home soon, he'll be good. I did park in the driveway, I hope. That's okay. He'll do. I can move it. <laughs> Just all the places around is where I can. Alright, um, and that will be my turn. Don't you get some good stuff? Mm. Mm. Alright. So, so that that's makes it, me. Yeah, that'll make me your turn. That was my turn. Yeah. Okay. See, I thought it'd go his turn, my turn, your turn, my turn, her oh, turn. So we each get one turn and <laughs> you get like a gajillion. <laughs> How does the group feel? Keep exploring or try and round back? Which one are you? You're her, right? Okay. I'm yeah. the Raven Claw. You're first. Mm -hmm. I'd probably round back. That's what that's just me. Okay. Does she be first? I agree. Uh, three. How old are you? 16, um, 18, <laughs> 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 Definitely one of the more elaborate games I've played. It's a good one. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay. I think the first time we played The Haunting started after like the third omen and it was like what? <laughs> 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 By the way, you're fucked. Yeah, <laughs> oh, it was actually Peggy's fault. Okay. But, it's not about you. Yeah. Um, like but I'm going to have to roll two. again, I'll try. <laughs> I might roll in that room. For, yeah, for what, the jump room? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, if you enter, then yeah. Yeah, yeah. okay. So, let me, let's do a might roll. A three And I need plus. four. Okay, four die. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So you get three or more to move out? Well, either way you move out, but... Three. Okay, that'll work. So I continue. One, one. two, three. Mm. Oh, you can only move three? Yeah, I'm oh, only okay, three. No. Do I get the event card for that one? No. No, because we've already done it. Okay. Yeah. And that's the end of my turn. Uh, Thank you. Traitor. <laughs> Alright, what are you doing now, bud? Uh, I'm sorry I made you into this. <laughs> Dirty rotten um, traitor. Yeah, Tyler had no part in this. He just, <laughs> he just got placed on him. But, you know, that's what you get for being in the pentagram. I like the little backstories the they kind of have with each hunt, though. It's kind of cool. So, yeah. It's interesting to see are you the, victim the right other now? side of it. Too. I'm just like, saying, like, 
That's what you get for this little like, thing oh, around the head. Who pulls this and then for him it's like, you have gotten you out of the basement. This, you, do you didn't this. mean yeah. to be in the basement. What do you mean? I fell in the basement. <laughs> you <laughs> you we fell on the castle. He only quickly. had one way to go. We <laughs> fell the stairs pretty quickly. He could have chosen which side. True. He could have been like, I'm going back up. Could have been with us. I was like, no, fuck this. You I'm know, staying in my chamber. <laughs> you know Scooby Doo. The rules are stick with the group. What are you talking about? Fred always splits up. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> the game always Can't, splits up. Don't do that. <laughs> I was just watching Scooby Doo this week. They're on HBO. Yeah, that's what I watched. Mm-hmm. Uh, Scooby Doo two, like the movie the, two, number two, the, yeah, the, 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 or as well. <laughs> the <laughs> animations and the real ones. Yeah. The real ones. Uh, For a different ridiculous, yeah. Real people. What I mean. Right. right. How many careers live in that? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> It's also just yeah. so weird to see written by James Dunn on that, now that I know who he is. Well, I didn't even realize that. Yeah, yeah. He, wrote the first, he wrote the two live action Scooby Doo's. He was a Guardians of the Galaxy dude, right? Yeah. Okay. And soon to be Suicide Squad. No, uh, take would, me to the stairs. I would happily give you love them. You don't have you to do know, the name. Nope. Love them. Only positives here. So, one, two, three. Oh, I only have three movements, so. Oh, okay. So, stay there. Okay. Crimson Jack's going to move over and turn. There it is. Whoever that is. No. Oh. That's <laughs> me. <laughs> yeah. Poor old professor. Yeah. He's going to stay there. I'm going to stay in my turn. I'm not comfortable with this. <laughs> Your turn. You can continue oh, <laughs> trying to roll into the vault. So, okay. knowledge roll of 6 plus. Yeah, when I pay off. Roll all of the... Just I really oh, that's, that's good. I mean, you, you can't. You, you can also read through that if you need to. <laughs> Let me see that. Tiny font. We're, we've already gotten through the first two bullet points. If you We're could just move over into the camera side. <laughs> <laughs> You went through two of the wall points, you guys haven't done anything. Don't listen to me. Don't, don't listen to what I'm talking. We need a group chat, guys. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't mean anything to me. Skype. It's, okay. look, Destiny and I are not opposed to being in group chats. Do you know how many so Just in case it changed your mind, I don't know. Mm. Four. Let me take a look at that, too. How do you attack with your monster? One, two. Oh, I come out here. Mm-hmm. That's a good question, Tyler, and I'm sure that book says it. One, <laughs> Don't two, exactly three, have the answer for you. Four. So please, yeah, you want to go that way? Mm-hmm. Oh. Did you I skip can. it? Yeah. You All right, guys, we got one free turn. We got to make a count. Good. <laughs> so you can't attack with a monster. That He's makes like, more sense. Okay. Oh, it was. I felt really good. I know, right? <laughs> All of us are like. Um, what? So who's turning it? Oh, did you go? Yeah. Oh, so I guess I'll shake this turn. Five, one, two, three, four, five, You have six movement now? Yeah. Oh, damn. Yeah. He's, he's fast <laughs> Go anywhere. Because he ran away from the spider. Also, you can just start in here. Or. I think so. I don't think I can do anything else. Okay, so my turn. That's right, bitch. So it does cost me yeah. two movement to move out of this mm-hmm. room. You gotta. You have to do something else. Before you leave, you have to. Roll a sanity roll, and if you roll below a three plus, you lose one point from a mental trait and one point from a physical trait. Oh yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I said that in arc too. Yeah. Um, so a sanity. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. So four after you three or above. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> so I lose one from each. Yeah. So I thought that's what the attack was. I didn't realize that they have an attack also. That's where the problem became. Do I still get to move? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. I thought so. Oh, yeah, that's just at the beginning of my turn, yeah. So, so now it's my speed, so four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, <laughs> three. Stop. And we're just going to chill there. And we are going to uh, do that knowledge check. Or whatever. Yep. Seems sus. It says knowledge or might. And it's five plus. So we should run higher. Minus three, so <laughs> knowledge, so five. So I need five or higher on five rolls. Got it. So I'm going to take the knowledge, put that on my character card, and then that description that really sounded very Jason like. I don't well, know if it did on your end too. No it is. <laughs> I was like it definitely sounded like right at their feet. No that is absolutely what this is based on. <laughs> I wonder what some of the other haunts are about. I know there's one that's like a teenage werewolf. Um, some kind like, of teen wolf. Right? <laughs> um, yeah there's a lot of different ones that so were interesting. there's nothing else I can really do. Um, one or the other, right? Yes, yeah. either of my other I could have moved one extra into the chapel afterwards just to end my turn there. Maybe I should. Uh, oh, that's oh yeah, that's nice. Okay, so I... Are you I, a knowledge or might? Uh, it's four, four either way. way. I guess you can do whichever one you want. Yeah, let's see if I even get it right. Do either of your own ones help you? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you need five or more. Is that what it is? Mm -hmm. That'll do. Thank you. So which one are you using, Mike? Knowledge? Um, I will go with a Mike. Which one were you rolling, though? It doesn't matter. It she was had a both. Right there were oh. both four, so that's why I was just asking her whichever one she passed on. I'll do my, and then I can zoom on out of there, right? Mm -hmm. Perfect. I will end my turn in the chapel, but that gains me a sanity. Very good. All right. Tyler's turn. All he's right. On, he's on the stairs. Little boy's coming up. Na, 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 na. He'll move it up in the world. Or he's going to stay down there, maybe? Na, 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 na. No. Okay. So. You want me? Okay. <laughs> yes. That's fair. It's a little boy comes up there. I need two of y'all to jump his ass. <laughs> okay. He goes there and start beating the shit well, out of this little kid. There are all two people he would join in on. So if I go up the stairs, either. we're going to come out on. We could hack. Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I didn't see that. Uh, it's, it's in that little book that Tyler has over there that we'll look at in a second. Yeah, I'm going to go upstairs. Go upstairs? Yeah. That's one. This is not a walkway, bro. He wants to differ. Right? They're doing laps. I'm going to attack the little girl. This. Yellow girl? Or the hell? Yes, yeah. <laughs> I like the little one. <laughs> I guess they're both kind of like little yeah. at this point. I have three might, so. So you also have to use your might. Yeah. You roll so however many dice I might you have, and you never have most wins. Yeah. Eeny, meeny, miny. Yeah. Nope. I would have two. So you would what? Lose one physical, I think? I would lose four. Oh, you lose the difference? Yeah. So you lose four. Four physical issues. Yeah. Does it have to be for Mike or can you split it up across your physical? Jeez. I think you can split it up. Jeez. It's only if you don't use Mike. Don't fight against Missy, I guess. She's a formidable opponent. True. With her Kujo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, this is physical damage. So you can split up the four across the two if you need to. 
That way you don't die. <laughs> Four's a lot of damage, holy shit. Mm, either way I die. Well, no, I think it's, uh, if I remember it correctly in there, if the difference is two or more, you only take two damage. That's not something I saw. I can find it in there if you need me to. So the amount of damage equals the difference between the two rolls. If there's a tie, no one gets hurt. Yeah, you can look for it. I've not seen any kind of specifications. Would it have been in the rules? No. Uh, under special attacks, if you attack someone and inflict two, oh, no, no. if you inflict two or more points of damage, you can steal a tradable item instead of inflicting the damage. Um, never mind. I thought I said. Never mind. Yeah. No, you're right. You're right. Really? Really? You are not. Moves <laughs> me. I know your whole chair looks like it shifted. Uh, so yeah, I guess that would be four da physical damage. Cool, so I'm dead. Little Billy Boy's dead. Let's leave his body sitting there. So, he looks crazy. So that's how, you a little girl. that's how you step on the random dead body. And so like, we can also <laughs> attack that same way as well. Oh, no, we attack yeah, that feeling skewed. I think it has to do, like, be a might attack unless you have something that allows you to do it. A uh, mental one. Oh, that's how much you get. Yeah. Uh, it's done. Who are you going against? Uh, you go against this one. Quick pull. More or less. Yeah, that's cool idea. That's a might attack. Might, might right? So, Twenty-five. Uh, I think otherwise. It might say his stats in your uh. And your traitor tone. Mm -hmm. Like, is there anything other than that? Mm -hmm. Monsters often use traits other than their might to attack. So yeah, I mean, it'll probably tell you like, what does it say under like under the Crimson Jack? I think it'll say like Crimson Jack, and then under the name Crimson Jack, it might say stats. Like a stat, does it? Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really give much. It doesn't tell me other than his stats. Like if he does something specific. So, so unless it says specify, I would assume it's might. Because like a lot of ghosts, they'll use like your mental ones instead of physical. So yeah, I guess we'll do might. Oh my god. You have five might? Yep. Yeah. Good god, that chick is strong too. Oh yeah, no. Ooh, ties, 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 no damage. Oh my god, not very strong. Strong, but you really <laughs> The dice just rolls are not with that one. Hanging out that All right, one. Alright, so I guess it's the end of my turn. Okay. Which... Beginning could, could be good because remember we read that if you defeat him he can come back stronger so that might not be a good thing either. <laughs> so now it's the beginning of your turn you need to make a sanity roll. Mm -hmm. You have to get You're saying he's only three? <laughs> yeah. What does she need to beat? A three? Yeah she needs a three. A three or more? Mm -hmm. Okay. Got this. Yeah. Got oh. this. No. Oh. Okay so you lose one physical and one mental. Mm. Then you can live your life. Choose accordingly. But if you want, before you leave the room, you can go over and smack the dead kid's face. <laughs> <laughs> Feel free to offer some. <laughs> no, I'm good. No, and then, and then it wants to come up an ally, wouldn't it? Yeah, it meant very least to, to me. What? That, that third so bullet good. point. Oh, yeah. No, you still get to take your turn now. That's just at the beginning of your turn I, you have to do that. Oh, okay. And so now you can still uh, move. Join the mm -hmm. okay. You probably want to do a knowledge or might judge, either one. Whichever one's higher, actually. Mm -hmm. They're both four. So roll yeah. and then Yeah, so roll and then one. you need a five or more. Remember, we can give things. Remember who you are. She mm -hmm. nailed that. So whichever one of these you used, you. It doesn't matter if it's yeah. the same stat. So just choose one and put it on your character. Don't put it up You yet. can give one as well as long as you're on the same time, right? You can also still give one what? if you want to. You can't necessarily give this, oh, okay. but you can give items or omens okay. if you need to. Um, and then after that you can move off if you want to. 
Cool. Uh, Jay Fern. Can I make a sanity roll? Yeah. Five. Three to three. <laughs> like the one that had a one already up on it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that'll do. Whoop, whoop. So I am going to kick the kid's dead body first. <laughs> for being petty. Exactly. <laughs> he tried to attack me. I, not only did I just kill him with this little flashlight or whatever I'm holding, I also am just going to kick him again. Exactly. <laughs> Seems like a good time to remind you that I'm going to be dungeon mastering a, a session with you tomorrow. <laughs> right? He's like, I'm taking notes right now. <laughs> and then we go ahead there. And then my turn. I'm going to let you know I've got five nat 20s. Solid. <laughs> <laughs> That's the ultimate. Yeah, I guess I'm well, gonna hop in here. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Did you make your. He did. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, he made it. Um, okay, so I'm gonna use knowledge, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Knowledge roll. I think you got it. Knowledge token. And. That is gonna end my turn. Oh, so I'm sanity. sanity. Not that at this point sanity seems really <laughs> useful, but... Well, it is if you end your turn in the same thing as Crimson Jack. I guess that's true if I lose one, yeah. That way I can always just take it out of sanity. Yeah, sanity is what you used to roll to beat his thing, so... Oh, it is? Yeah. Oh, you're right, never mind. I didn't think about that. Yeah, ma'am. Sorry. It's your turn, Amy. Um, I'm thinking, because he's obviously going to come after us. Yeah, but you know what you need to do. I, well, the first thing I ought to roll. There you go. That was out of the way, right? Four and four, correct? Uh, whichever one you want to use, yeah, might or acknowledge. If they're both four, then yeah, just roll mm -hmm. your four. You need a five or more. No. Okay. I think I was didn't do that. I'd say it's worse you can get, but um, <laughs> right, so you could get zero. <laughs> so here's the deal: I can stay, gonna make get me up to eight again. It's true. And get potentially got. I'll move away. I would think move. But that's up to you. How yeah. much can he move? No, we're not privy to that. No, okay. I think Tyler rolled for it last time. Okay. But. That's fine. I don't know how much you rolled, so. Mm. Could do one die, two die, three die, how? Any preference on where I go? Does the really matter at this point, does it? I mean, for me, I prefer you to stay in the same room, but that's just what it makes. Actually, you should have a 25% target versus. Well, it might be Jay Freight. I think there's. Something's telling me it might be Jay Freight. <laughs> 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 I don't know. <laughs> more advantageous to end in right now, but... Yeah, Amy? You can tell her. Yeah, but I mean, Tyler also tell Tyler. I mean, yeah, so. that's true. Or you can tell him. He's he looking away, I'm pointing at him, point at him. <laughs> Distract him, Luffy, distract him. <laughs> you know what, put it down in a text message. Oh my god. Yeah. Like a lot of effort. effort. I it mean... Like, it seems like it's really hard to win as a killer. Probably depends on which hunt you get. Yeah. yeah. You might not have gotten one of the best ones. Where everybody is and all Like, that I'm stuff. sure the ones that fucking attack your mental stuff, I bet some of those are fucking hard. Depending on who you have out on the board. Just because, like, with the physical stuff, sometimes you can use weapons to help you attack. With mental, like, there's probably a lot less to help supplement. Uh, Although there was a book card. Maybe a book can do that. I don't know. <laughs> if you attack with a book, it gives you plus two. No, I don't know. I didn't read what they do, but... You know, read what they do? What, every car in the item pile? Yeah, no. For right now, um, I'm going to up my sanity and I'm just going to stay where I am. Alright. I, I don't see a point in... Jack. ...quite moving at the moment when there's four of us sitting there. <laughs> I can move next the time. The are better. Sounds like, what all can I do? Alright, we're going to play this guy. Dead Pete needs to make his sanity roll. <laughs> <laughs> We're in the same room. <laughs> He's already insane. He's a traitor. 
So it's three dice. So you can move up to six. <laughs> okay. And he moved enough. That's all I know. Oof. Kill a dog. You know, just take a dog. <laughs> uh, Don't kick my dog. <laughs> Don't kick He's like, I'm not kicking dog. I'm kicking you. <laughs> I'm going to attack Derek's character. Oof. Okay. Whichever one that is. That's the big, white, tall lab coat, dude. Alright. The tallest is, one is in the room. Is this knight? Yeah. Okay. Old oh, man. Six. Okay. Can I see the rule book real fast? Right. I need to know if I can use a weapon to defend. I don't know if I can or not. Yeah. Well, it's a perfect page, actually. That. I'm gonna fuck! <laughs> okay! <laughs> I swear to God, if you try and do this again. He was like, I'm done. I'm sorry. Not really. Sit there. Lay down. And he walks away. Of course he does. Hey, bud. You said sit. Okay, cool. Come on. Hi. You want to hang out with Killer Seth? He's like, well, you're the one petting me, so yes. I don't know. I wonder if I. He's easy to lose. That's fair. You don't breathe so heavily on me. I think that would be. I don't think this would count as me making the attack. Probably. The presence mm-hmm. on both sides. Mm-hmm. See what? See what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh. Is there a second page? It's more like responding to his attack. Yeah, like that. So what, what about this one? Does this? It just says. Oh yeah. Her turn. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I'll I'll rub the idol. <laughs> so I lose one sanity. Yeah, you will. I'm okay with that, Tyler. Seeing as we've beefed up our sanity a little bit here. Yeah. Uh, so now I get to add two to my roll. Which will beat you. You know. Plus yeah. two for my idol. So oh, that's what you meant. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Then yeah. So. so. so what I does that mean? I need the rule book, you know. I <laughs> <laughs> like, this is my rule book. Oh. You need. <laughs> like, hell no, you can't. I swear, I swear I wasn't doing that. It's like, yeah, secrets sure. of survival, okay? <laughs> I've already given up on winning, so it doesn't matter. Really You're matter. like, I'm just trying to see how this game works now. <laughs> see through. Alright. Well, I have to do... Mm-hmm. Okay. So, he is stunned until the end of his next turn. I mean, you don't have to do a roll to... No, I think you still do. I just can't attack during my... I can't do anything during my turn. Ah, okay. So I still have to do what? No, the sanity rule. Mm-hmm. It'll, it, if so, it'd be in that section that says passing through an opponent. So, three. I think. And I have to get what? Maybe three plus. Maybe so five or more. For sanity? Oh, for that. <laughs> That's why. I, I thought we were talking about for the yeah. other check. I was like, check. <laughs> I haven't screwed. <laughs> mm. Do you want to do this first? Well, you, you know, you can't. When you start your turn, you have to do that. Okay, never mind. Sorry. So apparently you guys will use one extra space of movement to leave the room. Yeah, no, I knew that. Like, if we were in the same room as you. Oh, but I'm stunned, so I don't slow on Explorer's movement. Oh. So we don't have to do this? No, you... From what I can tell, you still do. You still do that. We just wouldn't take the movement. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which, I mean, she passed it, so... Yeah. Yeah. And so now you can either do the mind or knowledge roll. So four. Five or not. Five or not. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. well, Whichever one of those two you want. Mm-hmm. Well, I'll stay there, I guess. So I can. Why should I leave? Because he's in there. Why are you guys going to this? So you have to wait for me to come back. I'm just stunned right now. Stay right there. Are you stunned also? Huh? Are you stunned also? No. Oh. I just <laughs> said I'm staying there to bump up my sanity. Trying to bond with you and you just <laughs> ignore me. No, I'm sorry. Yeah. I don't want to yeah. be in stunned land <laughs> with you. So, yeah, no. Didn't think so. I didn't even think about the fact that if there was anyone viewing, they, they completely know our plan. 
<laughs> not a ton of time. Yeah. Hey, if you want to tell me what's going on, let me know. <laughs> He's like, if you want to, you remember the entire page that they read out loud, like, that was kind of mumbling over here just for us to hear. <laughs> I'll split the winning. I mean, he could have also been listening if he logged on on his phone. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, that many. I'm just saying. It seems like a lot of work. And it could have been an option for you. Yeah. Oh, you made it, yeah. Then, so, I guess so. I'm gonna stay there and take another sanity point. Are we all just sitting in the room? <laughs> <laughs> and we're all just like, nah, I don't know if we really want to move. It's like we're playing, if we've got trading cards and we're just sitting there with each other while the, the guy's just like, hey guys, <laughs> no, I, I'm really gonna, I'm gonna hurt you this time. I'm gonna get ya. So my turn. Um, mm -hmm. I swear to my mom, I'll kill all of you philandering teenagers. If it weren't for you meddling kids and that Pretty much. pesky dog. Exactly. <laughs> can that dog do anything? Can we send him off somewhere? I mean, technically, like six spaces away, yeah. He can do it. Ooh. Would it be a mean? <laughs> and that's my how you lose followers. Is going to. Just <laughs> after your sanity roll. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Four. Get back. Wait. Then I'm going to come stand over here by the entrance. Old new kind. I guess you can face off. And I'm going to end my turn. Feels a little weird. So that's me. I have to <laughs> roll against the beast. What yeah. do I have to roll? Sanity. Five. You have to beat a three, or you have to do a three more. Well, I don't know what you're saying. Oh my god. I have eight. So she needs all the dice. Damn. If she, she's I been boosting that thing. You're looking three plus three. That's right. a problem. Let's <laughs> roll with just three to begin with. That beats it. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna. Oh, what about the negatives on the other dice? <laughs> That's <laughs> not right. how this goes. Give me a marker. Alright, so. Negative. <laughs> <laughs> Um, now I'm gonna roll for one of these bad boys, so four. Mm -hmm. Oh look, look at that! I don't think you can though. I'll get you that. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. yeah. Why? Um... That hurts. I mean, it doesn't, but... I have to. Oh, no, you're right, you can't. No, mm -hmm. I'm done. I'm done. You're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah, dude. But I move three spaces, and before I end, I can roll for them. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. One, two, three. Now I roll the four. There you go. I'm just doing my taxes over here. Doing your what? My taxes. Oh. It's not even tax season. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm very late on mine. <laughs> Alright, that's what I'm gonna ask right now. Four, six, five. five. Six, that'll work. Yeah, okay, so I'm going to take a mic. Indubitably. Alright, Tyler is. Do you skip your turn and then you're unstunned, unstunned or do you do it at the beginning of the turn? That's at the end of my turn. Oh, so turn ends. The we'll lap game. Alright, so. Uh, there goes to you then. Wait a minute. Did I do this one? Three. Wouldn't have never read the term of tape, the term of traitors, Tyler. Did you miss it? Yeah, I'm supposed to die, die. Okay. Sorry, supposed to you. die? Yeah. How? Uh, I don't get stunned, I die. None of you guys oh, then you can die. Die, right? Yeah. Mm -mm. Cool, so it doesn't change anything. So I'll be at the entrance now. Oh. Great. So you do take your turn now? Yeah, because uh, you're not stunned, so you would take a turn, right? Mm -hmm. Does it take a turn to respawn? Or? The beginning of my next turn, I return. You take your turn as well? Yes. Okay, so yeah, I guess it would be your turn. Okay. Did you guys like move or anything? Mm -hmm. No. They haven't yet. Okay. Uh, she rolled the sanity check, but she now doesn't have to do this. She's not in that room. But. Okay. I don't know. I'll take Jake right now. You're not in the same room as me. Me and Amy are with you. 
Whoever has a small child is. That's not a small child, it's Madame Come on, this Sostra. one? The short statue. Amy's might is four. What am I what am I doing? You're rolling your might against his. You have to roll a five, you have to beat up five. Or tie. Two and oh, it's five. Hey, look at that. Okay, okay. So, cool. I. So nothing, you know, nothing happens. Okay. So, I am okay with that. The end of my turn. Okay. So. To roll for those. I kind of don't like that the tone is different from this. Yeah, I wish there was some. Like, I wish they copied some of those rules into the trader's tone. Yeah. Like, that would have been, like, a good. Maybe I'll, like. Maybe print out a small little sheet to put with each column. column. Yeah. That way everyone just has a copy of those rules and stuff. Yeah, if you like an insert, then we could just put the insert wherever we are. You yeah, it's kind of like, it'd be like a little bookmark too, yeah. I think that makes things a lot better. Jen, what did you do? I just went there. Oh, you moved. Okay. So Jacob's turn. I don't like that well, all of you are gathering in there. Did you not want to roll? I mean, does it, it help with anything? It doesn't. Mm-hmm. I mean, you can attack me. For those? You already have five. Oh, I, you, okay, I didn't even realize. Yeah. Don't forget, you can also attack me. I'm good. I just want to make sure. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, you can attack me if you want. Let me come back stronger than you could possibly imagine, but no big deal. No, wait, no, I'm good. <laughs> um, the just a few. Prime real estate over here, ain't it? Send you out. Uh, Sloppy ears. I was like, I want to send this dodge explore shit. That one, so we got the ground floor. Got a waffle in that. Turns out this ground floor has a bad effect and you just fucked up everything. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Jay Fred. Lose everything. Dining room. At least he doesn't have any of our tokens. <laughs> there, and we get an omen card. Okay. You just don't have to roll for the hot. True. Oh, she is. Yeah. Skull. A skull cracked and missing teeth. You take mental damage. If you take mental damage, you can take all of it as physical damage instead. Oh. That's good unless you got weak bones. True. Yep. Yes, we could. Mm-hmm. 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 Is that your turn? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to attack Crimson Jack using my spear, and I'm going to rub the idol. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to add, add four to my roll now. <laughs> and my might is three, Tyler. What's your might? Four. Of course it is. All right. Sure need that. All right. Okay. So I got six. Good God. <laughs> oh, that's tight. Yeah. Okay, then. So. Wait, well, you can add more again? Is that the spear? Is that what that does? Yeah, the spear will add two, and then this added two as well. And you can keep using the idol? Uh-huh. Every time I lose a sanity, though. Oh, okay. Which isn't terrible, considering we sat in the church for a while. Yeah. So now, Amy, it is your turn. That makes sense to me. If you would like to... Take to I? take my spear, you can take my spear if you'd like. Well, what am I rolling for? It seemed like a suggestion. I don't think it was. Yeah. Oh, you yeah. have to roll like against <laughs> a sanity thing. You do a sanity check. So if like, you'd you like. have to do a three plus. You may take this item, but also is if it just, you would not like, I don't care. Is the sanity <laughs> check still just a three or more? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't say it changes. It didn't say that. Like in ours, it told us it was three or more. So, I mean. I you would think, think it would go higher, but right? really not. Like, especially for like the sanity one, like you think yeah. it goes to a four. Every, t- every time we kill him, and he comes back. All right, now there's some more on your place. <laughs> You're good. That's four. All right. That's that? All right. Now. Now that I have that, if I I'm wanted to your guys take my spear, I can give you my spear. Okay, and then what would I Appreciate fight? That. With him, that might. Okay. This lets you ask the company. This lets you roll. Can I take anything else? Oh, I'm fucking stupid. I should have read that. This lets you add two dice to your roll, not add two to your roll automatically. Okay. So the idol. Okay. The idol 
Uh, but because it has a draw. Oh no, the idol adds two dice too. Never mind. Do you, do you want to? Oh, man, I've been dumb this whole time. Hold that's on. what I was thinking at first. Then you're like, <laughs> no, add two. Well, I didn't know what you were asking. Yeah, no, that's my bad. I was wondering that, but I was like, I mean, he has the card. So. Someone should have stopped me and said like, I guess Tyler kind of did. I just didn't know. Do you want to give me your idol? Can you give me the idol? I think I can only give you one item. Okay. Per turn. Yeah, it seems broken to give you every item. Right? Like, take all my stuff. <laughs> <laughs> like, all you of you just start have. passing each other. Like. No, I only have in the same room. Alright, so I you have to You guys have been staying roll... in the same room for the past half hour. Uh, same two rooms. We're hanging out. Two rooms. <laughs> this is what friends do. <laughs> Chapel <laughs> and entrance. <laughs> what, stay in the entryway? Yeah. That's what happens when you're so, trying to say goodbye to somebody and then it just continues trying to get rid of a ghost. Too good of a conversation. Yeah. 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 Supernatural yeah. serial killer. Yeah. Okay, no so I have to roll the mice, so that's four. Plus two. Because of your skill. And these two. And I'm going to try and kill you. I really do. We'll see. Honestly, we'll see at this point. Plus four. four. Plus. So five. So now yours is four, Tyler. Damn, your might is that high. Right. Four. So she has five. And then she gets two more dice. Oh, because spirit. spirit, right? Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Maybe that didn't work. All right, we win the game then. Do you? Because we killed you with the cursed spear. Oh, okay. Because we collected five of the knowledge rolls or might rolls amongst mm-hmm. us. No, I believe you. Crimson Jack shivers at the end of the weapon, but he keeps pushing his way forward, that terrible smile never wavering. Just as his hands reach for your neck, Jack fades from view and your weapon falls to the floor. As you leave, you look at Crimson Jack's portrait on the wall. The killer is gone. For now. Yeah, cue like creepy Halloween music afterwards. <laughs> Whatever's royalty free, right? Yeah. <laughs> Basically. That one keeps those three separate. GG guys, GG. Do we know how long that game did take? I don't know if anyone looked before we started it. I feel like maybe like an hour now, huh? I'm thinking probably close to an hour and a half. Probably close to an hour, yeah. Just trying to get we're a gauge on what the time of this game requires. We're two and a half, and I think after Cthulhu, because I remember thinking that we were later in and it was close to an hour. Okay. Yeah. I know Cthulhu didn't take super long. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> well, we can either end it now, or if you want to play mixtape, we can do mixtape. It's up to y'all. I've got nothing else to be doing. Uh, I'm just kind of shoving them all back oh, in okay. there. I didn't know if you wanted to. <laughs> no, they, them. like I, I want to like I need to find a place that sells like a lot of really small Ziploc bags, like those tiny ones. That way I can start. Going through my games and like separating what I need to. Sorry, get, Bear. <laughs> you can get them on Amazon. Can you like the small mm-hmm. game? Okay, I'll put that then. Because that'll help me separate a lot of my games. Maybe one day I'll be able to come home with them, but right now I just get trash bags. Do you if, work on Amazon? If you guys need trash bags, I can get oh, yeah, trash those bags. Oh, yeah, I mean, I always take trash bags. Same. <laughs> I was kind of sticking them on top of each other. Do they need to be I mean, stacked? Oh, they still stack in there. He's like, I already took over. I'm going to put it back. I need to put the coffins back on. No, I'm just taking them off. Alright. I'm putting it in there. I'm blocking it. Yeah, for real. Okay. Hmm. Who was this guy? Ox Bellows. Kind of looks like werewolf. I've got a chance to play a full game of this. That was cool. Or Daring and Flash Williams. Flash, come on. Save your videos. Where did the dogs go? Uh, I think they go under these. Or no, I've been putting them in here. No. Perfect. Items. Pants. Yeah. Not much. Dang it, everything. <laughs> right, I, I just do. 
Look, but I love you if I need you to stop. You come out too strong, I don't appreciate it. <laughs> So you want me to take the time to open all of mine? <laughs> it's just an ordeal for me to go over there, so... <laughs> it's gone. Who took it? Seems unlikely. I, was like, I haven't moved in quite a while. <laughs> That's part of the game, figuring out what happened to the game. <laughs> Since Tyler has probably played this one more, I'll let him explain how the game works. So it's a massacre. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I remember this one. Yeah. Yeah. I do too. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, wow. The special ability wasn't going to work I if see. people knew what it was. <laughs> I mean, this is fair. That's why I won't say anything. <laughs> but I'm, I'm a no. I distinctly remember. What's your knife here? Chef's knife. Seems a little flimsy. Yeah. You're going to feel it, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. We're we'll just going to use this instead. <laughs> Mm, that doesn't quite so you go can't with stick the... your cards in your knife. Like yeah, can you put the little pegs in that knife? Just stab it through the card. <laughs> you like, cut it. You could not. Uh, I know. I was like, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, okay, those are Jayford's cards. <laughs> <laughs> Jayford now owns this game and he's bought me a brand new deluxe copy. <laughs> I know. I was like, uh, I'd probably be charging him. That's just me. Edition. They're going to buy this one and escape the color of the expansion. <laughs> that was an expensive use of my knife. Oh, what about <laughs> stickers? And it's pretty cool. They do like a little card that tells you who prepared it for you. And they give you like little stickers. It's very nice. I like when they do the custom little things. Like yeah. when I got Exploding Kittens, they had like this little picture of a little cat. Like it showed like a cat, like I don't know how he was traveling, if he was like running or if he was flying on a plane, but it says is headed to Derek Moreau's house or whatever. And then it shows a house that the cat creeps into. Then it shows the house like with all the windows exploding out like it blew up. <laughs> and I was like, oh, thanks. <laughs> well, that looked like your house. Probably. That would be creepy. <laughs> like they look, like they actually yeah. look on the street view of the address that you put in. That would be, that would be, really that would be intense. That would. Yeah. You're like, oh, uh, too far. <laughs> so you'll take these little red dots and stick them in your knife. Yeah. So that's your help. Yeah. That's pretty cool. So there's mixtape massacre where you play as the killers, and there's escape from Taloks where you play as like the victims. Ooh. And you can actually combine the boards if you buy both of them. Yeah, so that's Some like of these are my baby victims. No, like, they're assholes. Like Carrie <laughs> would definitely not be a victim. She was the victim. No, Carrie was one of the killers. Yeah, but like she only no. I mean, story wise, we can I mean, see how she's she was the victim, but then she murdered 30 people. Like, out of retaliation. Revenge is the I don't think that makes it okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Back to out, some murdering is okay. Topic. Oh boy. <laughs> some murder is fine. Oh, you didn't get me it's like how the karate kid oh, is Johnny Lawrence. Oh, Thank you. <laughs> I got you, don't worry. I know. I thought it. This bag is like the perfect size and I hate it. But yeah, so each of you plays as one killer. I consider that the perfect size. Wow, oh, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll trade boxes with you. <laughs> I'll trade boxes with you. I brought mine. I, oh my god. <laughs> I forgot. Just, just so face. now can I stab the cards? <laughs> oh my god. I've got my box. Calm down. All of a sudden this face is... This was a prepared by... Look at the card. Who was it? <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> I want to say Otis. Cold them out. What card? Uh... Uh, might be in here. This is your first time. Take one or? No, I do You can use a knife. Oh, yeah. I have to use your knife, actually. Huh. Oh, no. That's fair. This actually is not. Mm -hmm. There you go. Now you get pristine. Pristine? Right out the rack. He's just over here stressing about his one. I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> they don't belong together. There you go. Brand new box. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I was going to say, this is like a nice box, too. <laughs> there you go. But Did we need anything in there? <laughs> Probably. I think it was empty, right? No. Uh, yeah, kind of. Are no, the character kind cards of. in there? No. no, the character cards he has. Oh, okay. Do we like? 
Pick one. Yeah, you can choose any of them. I don't understand what any of these things mean, so... Uh, here, I can show you the... Here's the abilities if you want to take a look. Okay, the outside of the box is the same. I have very I mean, I, I didn't buy like Kickstarter or anything, so I figured it would be. Are you just got off the website? Yeah. Uh-huh. You know I don't. I didn't. No, I was late to the party on this one because the, the last Kickstarter I did was Invasion. I, didn't, I should hop on that one. Oh, that was right, yeah, the Invasion. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't realize I had this one last time I played. Yeah. Does he, is this new or is this the same one? Same one. Oh, wow. Yeah. He eats people. Good. Who does? I didn't even, yeah, I didn't oh, yeah, even realize that one. To get. But yeah, I gotta start getting expansions for this one. Yeah, I've debated it a couple times, like, because I thought about getting, like, the bundle that came with, like, both of them before I bought this one, but I was like, ah, I don't know, that's a lot of money to spend on all of it together. Yeah. Like, no. I, I want to get, like, the Grim Reaper one, like, that expansion. The Santa Claus one would be kind of cool. Or, was it Krampus, or is it Santa Claus? I think it's Santa Claus. Sorry, if I park in your spot. Thank you. Do they do wear stuff for me all the time, so it's fine. Like lock in a top lock and then I'm not home. Oh, they came out with a new booster pack called Scare Pack. Mm-hmm. For this, yeah, and it, it has like an evil jack o' lantern dude. Oh, I did see that, yeah. Yeah. Because that dude looked really cool. I wanted to get that one. How much is that? Uh, uh, 10. Uh-huh. That was out of stock. So these little packs are pretty cheap. Look, you can get like one where it's like, put, like a long sleeve shirt of it. Oh, that's really cool. How much is that? 35? 35, yeah. Okay, 25 for a shirt. No, compared to the price though, it's only five bucks for the booster pack. For the okay. long sleeve. No, thank you. Yeah, Bad Dad, Scarlet. I want to get Invasion just because I like aliens. Yeah, the Invasion expansion seems really cool. It doesn't come with a board though, does it? Like that. No. Only two of them have the board. Yeah, only mixtape and Escape from Wow, it's sold out. Yeah, when I was looking before, a lot of them like were only they only had limited stock before. The black mask sounded pretty cool. Lockdown sounded interesting. <laughs> I still feel bad. My bad. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, you replaced it. I was I'm just glad I had the, the same yeah. game like to replace it. Yeah, Not the scotch tape. How much is the actual game? Oh, it's fifty bucks. I don't know. I was thinking it was like thirty bucks. Oh no, it's fifty. How much is the tall oaks? Is also fifty. Yes. Oh, dang. I think they were on a lot of sales, though. Oh, okay, that's why I've seen it. I'll probably just wait till the next Kickstarter and then hop on that Kickstarter, and then when they do backer kit, pick up. Pick up all the expansions, yeah. expansions you want. Uh, I'll be Hannibal. That's uh, recently watched that movie for the first time. Is that supposed to be the ring? Or the grudge? Uh, that is the ring. The ring. The ring. Okay. That's definitely Chucky. Mm-hmm. I kind of like the art. Really no, the shirt, shirt looks really cool. Like, I really like that art for it. They've been doing a lot of, I know it's the past couple of months, I don't know, maybe just because of everything that's happening, but they've been putting out like a lot of new merchandise, it's not just the games. It's fair. My nightmares are usually more traumatizing. I'm usually in the. I can do that. <laughs> Sitting on the box. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Never gonna live that one down. Yeah, I'm really not. Well, just gonna be I like, think it's gonna stick in my mind longer than it sticks in Tyler's for sure. <laughs> Water brand, gonna be sleeping, they're just gonna hear. 
mint condition. <laughs> <laughs> it is mint condition now. <laughs> Literally out of the packaging. <laughs> Let's see if you successfully tell me. Yeah, it's cool. They have a lot of really good expansions for this game, and then Escape from Tallulx makes it double as big. Double, really big. Hmm. Although every time I play this fucking game Brandon, he always comes and tries to attack everybody. That's what Tracy was doing. Yeah, he he just like start Tracy picking fights. Guy. Yeah, Brandon's just a lot better at it. And Destiny and I were like, yeah. <laughs> I think Destiny and I ended up winning the game. I don't know if it's her or wrong. Buddy says Dolly's pardon. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they have more expansions than they have. I don't know Excuse me. You can only use the ability once per game, right? Oh uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you got the token. You blow that token. You blow that load, it's over. Well, that's no fun. Mm. There's no recharge, this is over. It's mm. unfortunate. Let me smile again. Thank you, thank you. I, I think I you pulled out six. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think. Exactly. <laughs> Except this, this is swole, Pennywise. Uh -huh. Oh boy. Pennywise getting the gains. We do some BT. Jaybird, what scene was that where he said that? Uh, Which? <laughs> <laughs> like, I feel like there was a couple. Yeah, there were. There was more than one, but one of them. Wasn't there one in the sewer? Uh -huh. What was the exact line again? Probably. You'll float too? Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Are we talking about the old or the, the new? The new. Yeah. yeah. No, I mean, I well, there was the one. scene where yeah. Georgie's in the flooded basement. That's what I was thinking, yeah. That was There's the, the original oh. when Georgie meets Pennywise down in. I think he says it too. No, I don't think he does mm -hmm. actually. He doesn't. I think we he did in the old one, he might have, uh, yeah. This is something, yeah, we all float down, down here. In the old one, I remember he says it to the other kids. Like as he's meeting them one by one, he says it to a couple of them. We have a new one. I don't think he says it as much actually. Yeah, the Jordy scene's the only one that like I remember. Really. Yeah, where he's like yelling at Bill. Yeah, like, you'll float too. And he attacks him. Yeah, and then like, like he dunks underwater and the clown pops up or whatever. And he just fucking books it up those stairs. And then Pennywise gives up because you know it's too hard to go upstairs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, obviously, not true horror fan, you can get away. I mean, I never claimed to be a horror fan, so no. there's that. Maybe you should be, Jay Frank. I want to say be. there was one in the sewer, though. I mean, probably, yeah. Yes. I don't know. It's a very popular line for him, I think we can all agree. He's his usual taunt. Ross is Bill. And then he's just like, oh, well, Georgie's dead, bitch. <laughs> it was good enough for Georgie. <laughs> 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 It just feels right, you know? It just feels right. I don't know, it feels a little light to me. <laughs> well then. So you, you, did you ever find a Never on Elm Street movies? Uh, I found them for rent, but not yeah. streaming. Never on Elm Street? Had a Bloodfest On Disney Plus. <laughs> Sorry, I had to. What? Disney Plus? On Disney Plus. Nightmare on Elm Street? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Chris, <laughs> Nightmare Before Christmas. Christmas. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. yeah. I, that's why I wonder why you said movies. I was <laughs> like, do you mean like Corpse Bride 2? <laughs> like... I was sitting there going, why would they have that on there? I mean, they have The Simpsons. It's like in Fox, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Technically. It's not Disney Plus friendly. Nightmare on Elm Street. Now. Disney can actually It's got Johnny Depp just like, you know, uh, all the fucking Anastasia, others. Cool. Thumbelina, yeah. Yeah. 
I don't know about Small Princess, though. Mm. He was he was very young in the movie, so that's why. Yeah. Was, his first actor, right? I don't know. was it? Because yeah. Thumbelina and Anastasia were by the same. Yeah. No. All right. I think at the time that was the most that was the bloodiest scene in movie history. The bed scene, yeah, where he dies and shoots up all the blood. Yeah. And so I I love horror movies, so. I love giant. <laughs> I love giant dead movies. I love both. <laughs> all right. Uh, so everyone starts on one of these knife spaces. I'll probably start there since it's closest to me. Of course. Okay. Maybe that will help this box. Open up the new box, right? Nice. Yeah. nice it's too snug. new. It's not going down. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't promise it. anything else. I just had to replace it. <laughs> it's like it hasn't been worn. I mean, I've got this other one, but I don't think you want it anymore. There we go. <laughs> Breaks. <laughs> He's not replacing Some of these linen one. finished ones do get a little more complicated to open. Yeah, it's yeah. just very smooth. Mm-hmm. Which is like nice. And that one's not even the linen finish. I don't even know what that one is. Like, that's a super nice one. Like that. Super paranoid now, too. Yeah, there we go. He's pulling it open, and that one just tears in front of my eyes. I'd be like, Tyler, <laughs> no! <laughs> hey, I already got the dice out of it. Okay. I don't know where the card went, which for the guy who made where, this. Where's the extra knife, but you can put that stuff away. Put, yeah. yeah. We'll put them all away nicely once we're. Just throw the shit in you. Dun, dun, dun. I don't even like this game. I figure it might be easier to split them up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so yeah, so every, all of us roll the red die first to see who goes first. Oh, Amy she go first. She's a strong contender. <laughs> Only sometimes. That Six. was also loaded dice. <laughs> Six. <laughs> Ooh. One. Ooh. Opposite. She went a different way with it. But it's opposite side, so that means the magnet was on the opposite side this time. <laughs> One. It's only sixes and ones. <laughs> oh my god! Tyler's fucking die is loaded. Okay. Alright, the two of y'all can okay, use my own D6. <laughs> right. Oh Six. <laughs> two. Okay. That's only because of interference, so. True. Yeah. I'd rather yeah. just do it so you like that stuff. It was a wonder, yeah. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> stop trying to accuse me of what's true. Okay, so I got first. Well, so, like, explain the general rules. Yeah, okay. Right. So, here's what you do. You kill kill each other. No, actually, we got to put. I was going to say, aren't some of those tiles. supposed to be out yeah. there? One on every location, right? Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Put oh yeah, we'll be the ring girl because that's her spot. Sure. Sure. Roadhouse bar. Roadhouse. Yeah, luckily we don't have to worry about that one this time around. I knew you guys had to figure out how to pick them. I was actually, I actually looked at your character and yours was the first description I read in that book. And I was like, Tyler's I, sneaky ass is going to choose that one again, thinking I'm going to forget. I, I Even though played, I already brought it up I was going to say, how would I forget? I played him last time. He's a decent, but I don't think I ever used like a special ability. Alright, so, all of us, obviously, play murderers, killers, ding, ding, ding. monsters, what have you. So each of you have a different ability you can use once a game, so hopefully you know what that is. If not, let me know and you can look in the book again. So all of us take turns moving around the board. So we roll the red dice first and then we can walk out how many that is. Uh, if you hit the green, those are bonus tracks, which can either help you or hurt you. And then if you hit, if you go into the blue, you go into each location, you pull a killer scenes dude or the yeah, killer scenes dude uh, card, and you either have to roll to win, or you get fucked like that. So there's cards that you roll, and if you roll a certain amount of knives, you get you get the token. And then there's cards where it's like the survivor, where if you don't get the amount of fists, we all get hurt. And then there's ones that just immediately attack you, and you can either roll for fists, or sometimes it tells you to just take damage. Okay. So, first person to get ten of the souvenirs. little souvenirs wins, or if you, or and then Last you can actually game. start attacking people too. So, and if they run out of health, then they die all the way. Okay. So, so and their like, souvenirs just go to the discard pile. They're out of the game. Yeah. Right? yeah. 
But I think so. Let me double check on that one. Do you steal people's stuff? If you land on the sewers, you can transport to the same color sewers. Yep. Yeah. And then these injections give you life, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it gives you one health. Mm hmm and you can't share spaces. Mm. And for example, if I'm like standing right here, you can't enter that building, I think, right? You can, you can pass through. Oh, you can still yeah. pass through, okay, okay. But they'll probably come in and attack you. <laughs> you just can't land, you can't just stay on the same, end on the same space, correct? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then all the red knife zones are starting zones, obviously. Yeah, so when you die, you go to the nearest knife, mm -hmm. and start over. Unless, Unless like, you reset. lose all your health. Yeah, once you lose one health, you go back to one of those. Yeah. Or they reset your the entire world, which means everybody goes back. Okay. Because there are those. Mm -hmm. uh, if you end up killing the survivor or victim, that's at the location you go into a killing spree. So when you roll, you get double the you get double whatever your roll is. Okay. So if you can get to another location, get the killer scene, you keep doing it. It's called a killing spree. It's within one turn, though, right? Yeah, yeah. Because if you kill someone, do you roll again, or is it within one roll? You roll again after you kill someone, cool. and then you just double that. Uh, Don't forget your special abilities. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about getting the car getting the souvenirs, so I okay, think cool. Yeah. I didn't think so, but Yeah, I was pretty sure not, but at the same time it kinda of made sense so I was like, <laughs> uh, Yeah, and then if you roll triples of the either the knives, the fists or the pentagrams, it does special things. So when that happens I'll just tell you because telling you right now is not gonna do anything. Yeah, we'll but, yeah. what? but then I won't know how to aim for triples, Tyler. I mean, you should, first of all, how are you aiming at triples? Mm. <laughs> There's a way to roll dice. I don't know it. I, mean, <laughs> I feel like if you knew how to roll dice, you would have gotten a six. Seven, well, one. if the red one's <laughs> loaded. <laughs> if the die wasn't loaded, maybe I would have. <laughs> all right, uh, so Amy's going to go first. So she'll roll and then she moves. It's pretty easy to pick up. One, two, three, four. I'll go ahead up here, which means I get to pick a green. Is she dead? Tall oak children believe this cemetery to have healing powers. Revive yourself to full health. The fuck? Oh, at least in Cardford. Sorry, you know. So I'll just, I'll hop onto that and put that there as a discard. Okay. I thought you meant hold on to it. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> um, <laughs> hold no, on now. <laughs> because I'm sure eventually we'll have to like mix them up. Shuffle or something. So I went to a skate park, so if you have any killer scenes, do you dun, 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 dun. So you need one knife, right? Yes, so I got at least one knife. And does the skull mean how many souvenirs you get? Yeah. So sometimes, even though it's one location, you get double souvenirs. Cool. And you got none. Wow. Yeah. So now that I didn't get it, I don't like lose health or anything. I just stay there and then at the beginning of my next turn I just pull another card and then do whatever that card needs. Okay. So you can discard that. So it's Jules' turn. A discard as well. I was gonna say might as well put them in the discard. Oh no, that's separate type, so I'll just have that right there. I thought it was easier to split them up against. No, I mean that works too. Yeah. So you want to transport to another sewer? Yes. Or do you want to get in the building? I can't quite fit in the building yet. I'll just stay right here. Stay for it. Bitch roll. Yep. It's surprising you chose a longer deck. I know, isn't it? I don't know. It makes perfect sense. I just remember Tracy just roaming around the bull trying to get us with that one. Yeah, he kept coming after me a little bit yeah. longer. Didn't really do anything. I had, wait, I had to waste my special ability on that bitch. Brandon was surprisingly lethal. I was like, yeah, bitch, you're wrong. <laughs> right? I was like, dude, that thing's even worse. I'm on two, two spaces on my dudes. turn. On one side of the pool. Oh, it's me again. Yeah. 
Three. She's doing the moonwalk over here. True. One, two, three. Wait, I love you both, but go lay down or something. <laughs> Alright, yeah. Can I get a card? No. So, Alright. You have to get into the building, not on this space. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, you yeah. Can. Ah, okay, thank God. So this is mine, and then I go into a killing spree, so I roll this. And now I can go four. Not much of a killing spree. One, two, three, four. Bonus tracks me. Sometimes you can get run over in these. I got run over last time. What? Hmm. Nothing can be bandages. Bandages won't fix. Revive yourself with one health. I know I shuffled these. Lame. Alright. So it's Jules' turn. When do we reload? Not until oh, all, all of them are taken. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we go in here. Yeah. So... Uh, no dial tone, how strange. The victim is open for attack. Kill him. So Kill him. You need a knife. One knife. Get him. Like how Connor asks, like, like if we're down, I'm like, what are the details on this fucking thing? Where so, and when? Like, so you won. You get the token. Yeah. And I got a killing spree, so you can roll again, and you'll double whatever you roll. Okay. Go merc time. That's true. Can you Ooh, can get twelve. It. Oh. You can get to another location that way. Mm -hmm. That's true. Or you can kill Jayfred. Or you could die. Seems like a waste. I'm thinking but, killing um, Jayfred doesn't really get you anything. I mean, personal satisfaction. Yeah, I guess. The thing about all this time has been annoying. Sure. I can be released 15. So, another... Killer scene, dude. Take a hit of this. Just about to run this board. Yeah. So, yeah. Want to do it again? Yeah. Yep. Oh, man. Yeah, your spree continues spree. until you stop. Okay. Until you stop killing. Three, six? Yeah, six, yeah. Uh, another one. Another one bites the dust. Uh, so, what do I have to get? Oh, you end up. You have to get two fists. Yeah, if you don't get two so, fists, you take two damage. Oh, okay. So, okay. Oof. I didn't see that. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fist it. No. Oh! You got a special ability. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Why? Alright, so. Come on, get ten pieces. This is my last one. I wasn't even laughing. So, you, sur you survive, and all of us take one health. Or lose one health. Okay, oh, so wow. I just survive, right? Yeah. 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 So you'll just chill, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thanks a lot, Rachel. That doesn't specifically say that, but that's what I'm assuming. It was like. Mm -hmm. Dude, so they teased a pop album today of Hybrid Theory for the 20th anniversary. Really? Yeah. That's pretty nice. I don't know that. Mm -hmm. I, I've always loved the Hybrid Theory guy on front. So if mm -hmm. I get a pop of him and the little animal, then I gotta be a perfect set piece. Yeah, that's a knife. That really cool, Keep this card and add an extra knife to an attack or brawl when needed. Okay. Not a bad one to have. Yeah. Where we're going, we don't need roads. Move your character to the sewer shortcut of your choice. You may use the shortcut on your next turn if you choose to. Well, doesn't really do much for what I wanted, but I'll go over here. We'll do it anyway. That's all I needed. Whatever it is, doesn't matter. Alright, I need a knife. She needs a knife, she needs a knife. I need a knife. Got three knives! Good job. Double the amount of souvenirs. Oh, so you too. It doesn't matter what the souvenirs are, right? No. Ah, oh, lovely. I got a finger and a tooth, guys. There's oh. special game scenarios they list where you can, do, like, you have to make a monster. 
so you get like ten unique souvenirs that are supposed to put together the monster, but for the regular game it does not matter. Okay. Cool. Um This is tricky because if I I think it got one, two, three, four. I'll just hang out here. Your turn. You know, put the dice there so aggressively. Ah. <laughs> You're scaring the child. The child is scared of everything. I can look in his direction and he gets scared. Okay, can you not do that? Yeah, yeah, I'll make sure. I could use my special ability against him. Mm. What? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Refrain. <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's not really worth it at this point. You need two knives. We get three souvenirs. Really? Yeah. Oh, damn. Nice. She did not get two knives. Okay. Missed opportunity. Especially she's about to run the board. You're doing really good, J. Fred. Thanks. Really good. <laughs> trying to give you guys a comfortable lead. <laughs> I got a participation kill for you. Appreciate it. Can you move diagonally? No. No. Bitch. Oh, yeah, there's one over there. I didn't realize you could get it. That's a weird angle. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah. We go in there. Survivor. So I need one knife. Are these your keys, man? Where's that? Oh, please. <laughs> you just kept on trying. Alright, we'll take that. So I get one souvenir. Eyeball. You got the knife, you got the knife. Oh, I can it Mm-hmm. So eight. Mm -hmm. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, inch. Yeah. Do you have to use all your movement? Uh, I don't think so. I mean, I guess you get to stop inside these whenever you want, huh? Yeah, it's kind of what I was thinking. But you know what? No, I'm over here. And end my turn. That's me. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, it doesn't say anything Thank about you. using all of it. Okay. Woo! Boom. Oof. I'm going this way. Making some real moves right now. Come on, on three. Oof. Alright. What's my scene? What did you need? Three? Four? I need at least three to get in. Oh. Okay. Oh. God. So you're just trying to survive on that? Oh, you don't even get to do anything? No. Nope. You just immediately get shot. Yeah. Kinda looks My like... Back to the Future dude. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Doc Brown did me in. This guy pulled you so tough. There you go. I'm gonna say that's really tough. You don't have to. You're still on the scene. Oh, yeah, you don't need to roll if you're still on the scene. If you want the scene, you were kind of given the scene. You don't have to take it. Oh, true. <laughs> Derek, I got tired of it, so I emailed oh, Shipper on to me. Did you? Asking if I can go ahead and cancel the port lineup. Because like, we're just waiting at that yeah. point. Like, we've already decided we don't want to go because they're taking too long. We'll see how long it takes them to get back to you. Yeah. <laughs> right? I was like, what am I going to ask? And I was like, because I'm really just to get tired of taking this out every day. You, you know, get in there one day. One of these days, right. you're going to get a really good <laughs> roll. It's going to be this one. Well, I want to I wanna kill here and then like yeah. do doubles enough to go kill right. here and then go here before he gets to go again, you know? <laughs> I would really hate you. The, yeah. dice, would really, the dice would really hate you. So. Well, you can go there, straight in the I think bed. it's already clear they do. Three. Go on here. I need one knife for one. It's about to get real dark. Yeah. One night. Ooh, one kill. Never ha. So, one night. Two uh, you got the knife. So, got that. You got the knife. You got the knife. So, so. that'll be enough to go in there. <laughs> uh, I need one knife for two souvenirs. But. Double but, souvenirs. Yeah. I think we all take a damage too. I think so. Uh, I need double souvenirs. You have double the amount of souvenirs but and all of us lose one health. Doesn't so everybody get souvenirs? that because I got that last time? What? There. I you got double souvenirs, souvenirs last time. Oh shit, you're right. Yeah, but did you get three pentagrams? Was that not what no, I got? You got three pentagrams. She got the pentagrams. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I've got two eyes. I can't make them. The pentagrams are useless unless you get all three. And a skull. Ugh. And a brain. You gonna roll again? This looks like it's gonna be a short game for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm already getting hella. <laughs> Uh, At least you have one. Oh, there's only the one spot on the map? Yeah. Oh, I thought there were two. Can I see? Uh, yeah. Okay. So, ten. Oh, damn it. Yes, one, two, three, four. Five, you can six. find that. No, I did count right, motherfucker. Okay. You can find that. I almost got to her. I could. Almost. I don't want to fight her. I have no reason to fight her. You fight her, too. That's true. If you if you get to the entrance and he doesn't get it the first time, you can go in and brawl him for it. Who, me? Yeah. You're right. I, c- I mean, he's got one chance. Axe. One shot. Okay, I'm a one opportunity. <laughs> I'm gonna go in here and try and do the. I don't have to brawl her. I can do the case, right? You have to brawl her. Oh, I do have to brawl her. Capture it. And just let it slip. <laughs> If I defeat her in the brawl, do I still get to go again? Alright, eight mile. <laughs> uh, you have to wait till your next turn. Oh, well then what the fuck's the point of that? Uh, yeah, there's no, got no business doing that. Yeah, I'll just stand right here. Hi. Howdy. <laughs> okay. I guess that was... Oh no, okay, if you go in there, you can draw a killer scene with a healer. Oh, I don't have to. Oh, if I beat her? Yeah. Oh, okay. Because it's still going to fight me. Yeah. So worth it. Probably. If you win, yes. If not. And there's a higher percentage of you getting this token going in there than waiting another turn. I mean, that's, a, that's a fair point. How do we brawl again? Just higher roll? Higher fists. Higher or, fists. Sorry, no. Higher knives, I think. Higher knives. Yeah, yeah the most knives. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll attack you. Well, I got three pentagrams. What does that mean? <laughs> I'm going to guess you. I mean, I win? <laughs> so that means that Jules loses two health and gives one of their souvenirs to you. Okay. And then she goes to the nearest starting point. And then now I'm going to go ahead and there. go for the thing. There you go. I need to go back there. Quick, before he eats it. What was that? Yeah. Hey! Bird! What is it? Him that time. Luffy? <laughs> Whatever you want. Ah. Oh, yep. Two damage. I remember that one. Honestly, you're flying a little too close to the sun, so we need to burn you a little bit. True. Oh, well. How many souvenirs do you need? Don't worry about what I got. To win? Ten. Yeah, as well. Seven. Don't worry about what I got. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's what you're worried about. <laughs> she knows what she got. <laughs> Alright. Your turn, Annie. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about it. I'm, I'm thinking. No, I'm... right now. Go, 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 go. Fine. Come at me. She's come not, at me, Amy. She's trying to come at me. That's what she's doing. Uh, I mean, she was right there waiting for her mean, to come out of there. That's why she was looking at the abilities. <laughs> I know, right? Logistically, she's like, what does Tyler do? <laughs> it wouldn't be a bad move, but do I want to really kick Tyler Don't out of the game your kills. so quickly? He kicked me out of the game. But also, Dude. kind of depends like, on what you roll, so. <laughs> so. I was like, I do it. I'm not going to lie. He's like, I'd take you I out. I was like, she's won too many games already. She's not invited back. Whereas I could get you and could lower you? you down. I could. Okay, feeling that's how it go. Give me the rule book again. My, I'll, I'll tell you right now, my ability allows me to auto-defeat you in a brawl. I mean it. Uh, oh, yeah. But it's not a brawl. If you attack me, it's a brawl. Yeah. Yeah. I can auto-win a fight is what I think does. Yeah, if you lose this. Um, my task is not necessarily called a brawl. I'm talking about if you attack me, that's called a brawl. Yeah, but my oh, special yeah. ability yeah. is not a brawl. Oh, I see what you're saying, I see what you're saying. No, that's true, you're right, you're right. That would help knock you down a little. Oh, yeah, the, you right, have to be okay. strategic about some of these things, because I'm like, if he hits I thought you meant, back, like, in a brawl, if you were to use your, I was like, wait, what? I don't want no, to necessarily hit him if he comes back at me. You want to make sure he's down. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll be straight up. I'm gonna I'm fight back to anyone who comes and picks a fight with me. I'm a vengeful motherfucker. You literally are. That was only just because I had no choice. I'm sorry. Well, no, I don't care. <laughs> like it's a game. He had a choice. He chose to get attacked. That's right. It's just a game, which we're very serious about. Yes. Well, I don't like to lose games. I lose them often, I just don't like it. You lose it a lot. I don't think much. most people like losing <laughs> games. <laughs> That's fair. 
Some people are all about having fun. I like yeah. it. It gives me a reason for it. <laughs> <laughs> Need a reason? Every time I lose. Oh, well. <laughs> My therapist said I do. Um, yeah, okay. um, you know, like your dream is under control unless you have a reason for it. I think I'm going to save it for right now. Big mistake. Huge. Is it? <laughs> because we still need to clear out the gold. That's true. What happens once they clear out? Do they all restock? Oh, okay. Yeah. Just instantly, magically. Three. More people show up. Yeah, all those buying parts just fly. Oh. <laughs> 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 okay. Um... Go and attack tools. Or you get close to that gate where Tyler's coming out of. It's really a lot of work. Yeah, I'm not really. <laughs> Tyler, <laughs> to be quite honest right now, you don't pose a real threat to me. I'm, I apologize. Like you remember that. <laughs> I mean, that's fair. I got one and I'm two of them. Yeah, <laughs> he, he's not really that Who has big. Who's the most healthy? Japer or you? Um, tied. Tied. Yeah. We're tied, and then the all two are tied. And then so I am going to. If you land on the sewer, can you use that as one movement to like move, or do you have to wait till your next turn? You can use one movement to move. Okay, so like, yeah. One. I four. think that's probably oh, what I'm going to okay. do. One, two. Oh. Three. Yeah, it works. Three. three. So, well, you can move one more space, I think, right? No, that's you score. You Moving three, right? Moving is three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, were you diagonal to it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Never mind. So yeah, one, two. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright, kill seemed to right. I feel like the first time we played this we didn't get like any triples on these black dice, and now we've had like three or four <laughs> sets of triples. Alright. <laughs> Reach. Reach. Just <laughs> put it right in the <laughs> hey, There you hey, go. This is mine now. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, four. One. I mean, I think it's the same way around the arch. Two, three, four. You know, I'm surprised yeah. you can't go through the arch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It kind of looks, that's what I was just thinking, actually. It's an arch, but right? the, like, whole, <laughs> the whole thing is... Look how limber I look. I could just limbo into that bitch. <laughs> right? Like, boom! I mean, that liver How so. small is that bridge? Yeah. Oh, how? Yeah. That could be very small. So that's your turn? Mm-hmm. Oh, so so we're playing golf scores, right? <laughs> Whoever has the fewest tokens wins. <laughs> oh, oh, just... I need a one. I don't know. Oh. oh man. I needed that man. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> See, that was bummer of a day. That was better. <laughs> Glad I could help. Oh, I'm gonna go over here. You bitch. I like how you already knew that he could make it. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I already counted the spaces earlier. It was, it was 10, and I just got 12, so I know I'm good. Please. Oh, oh damn. Okay. Brawl. But now you have to brawl me. Yeah. All right. Well, on your turn, I guess. I guess it goes down here next, huh? Yeah. That's usually what I thought was good. She's actually going to come in here and swoop it for both of us, so. <laughs> actually, she's probably going to go to the roadhouse bar. <laughs> like, Why would I want to go that way when I've got nobody oh, on this section? Oh, I didn't see that there was nobody mm -hmm. there. Let's mm -hmm. go to the roadhouse bar. So. No one's thorn this time, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I checked who had that ability. I secretly grabbed that token. <laughs> Chain master. <laughs> Someone who's not. She's like, no, I want some fucking health. I need to watch that movie sometime. Health would be good. Which one? Hellraiser? Oh, I've never seen it. Me neither. No, no. Good? Never seen it. Mm-hmm. Uh, when... That's Pinhead, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I've never seen it. When HBO loaded it's up all of the Alien good. movies, I watched all of those. So random. You probably okay. got to watch them. Mm -hmm. they, they're a good series to be watching. Yeah, no, they're really good. Though I did see they uploaded Alien vs. Predator, and I'm like, mm, do I want them? I like that one. It's not the best story. I wasn't crazy about it. Like, yeah. So the idea of it was cool. I was like, okay, let's watch these two fucking fight. The action was cool. The story was kind of dumb. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I might have already seen it, but somewhere do not, there. Do not watch ADPR. 
<laughs> yeah. You really need to roll. The whole, the whole Pred Alien thing All right, sounded okay. amazing. And then they did the movie, and the movie was garbage. One. Does he have to claim if he's going to use that before I do my roll? Or after? Uh, I would have to know what it is before I can say that. I mean, not that I really have a choice of spell the roll. I, mean, use, but I definitely don't have to claim that I use it before. So. No, it's only if he dies. Oh, it's a die thing? He, it gives him one extra knife if he's gonna die? I'm talking about his knife card thing. Oh! Because uh, it gives him plus oh, one knife. Oh, I didn't even yeah, he that. would have to say that before you roll. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so we tie. Yeah. Uh, so I believe you roll again. Okay. Until one of us defeats the other. Fight. Until someone dies. We're evenly matched. Your chainsaw can't cut through my wicked hair. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna go ahead and use my card. Now he uses it. Two. So, so he has three. three total. So you need three. <laughs> so let's think. You lose a health. Uh, well, true. You do have What happens if I do do I just lose one health and go back to the starting zone? Yes. Does he get a souvenir from me? No. Huh. He didn't roll. He didn't roll triples. Uh, yeah. mm-hmm. It depends. We want to add that. that if we, I we wouldn't. I wouldn't three. necessarily call it that. I don't think so. Yeah. 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 Oh, okay. I did not roll triples. All right. So, so it's, it was a thirty twenty. So, so, yeah. yeah. I was like, <laughs> what are we talking about here? Oh, I was like, that's okay. Um. I wouldn't, because it's... You wouldn't, what, use the ability or wouldn't take the hit? Wouldn't use the ability. Yeah, it's kind of... It seems a bit of a waste. Yeah. Yeah, I'll let him. Yeah, you already got such a lead, like, it seems kind of crazy. Yeah. Well, I mean, I also don't have a whole lot of health either, though. So now I roll for the... Yeah, you do that that thing. Where are you headed? Turns out it's just a negative two damage. I'll immediately be like, (laughs) ha! Oh, you need two fists. Hold it over here. Huh? I'm strategizing. Viewer check, how you guys nope. doing? <laughs> so I lose two health? Is that? Mm-hmm. Yes. Did you not? Oh, you didn't get, yeah. Oh, tough one. I don't, I don't like those. Mm-hmm. I don't like those. How does this lay out? Are there, are there two of everything? Okay, there are two. Yeah. That's just my turn. No, that's a survivor, though. Nice try. Oh, the survivor's kind of cool because everybody else gets fucked as well. Damn. Can't do anything! One, two. Then you can lock three. Which three do you want? You want the <laughs> left three or the right I want three? That three. Where it has fun. Interesting. <laughs> Finally, it's PTSD. burned down. I am smiling. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. PTSD. So, Hellraiser's secret ability was literally to burn down if somebody was in it. And none of us caught on to it. And, or I, I think some it. of us did, but it was yeah, Tracy who got in there. It was awesome. Does it auto kill whoever's in there? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I wasn't sure if it was auto kill or just damage and just happened to kill. It was just satisfying from the walk in there. Yeah, it was awful. Because Tyler saw it coming. <laughs> and I hated him. Okay. okay. Luckily, he was the second one out that game, so yeah. I was okay with it. But it was still a long time until Tyler got out. I was just sitting here like, son of a bitch. I don't think I've won a game of Mixed Team Master. <laughs> I was always Did you win ours? Or no, Destiny won ours, didn't she? Uh, it was one, one of us two, because it was us two against Tracy. Tracy, yeah. Tracy, was, Tracy trying was trying to, to kill us. <laughs> I think one of us ended up having to use our special ability oh, to you to get him off. Just right there. I know. Yeah. Woo! I know. Big moves. Making money moves. <laughs> she blocked the sewer, so you're like, fuck, I have to go over there then. Mm-hmm. Are you gonna roll or are you gonna go for the. There are two knives. Got two souvenirs. True. Man, if only you hadn't wasted that thing on me. I know. <laughs> two lives. <laughs> Alright, my turn. Right, no, no, no mine, that's not lives. lives. You don't lose the other one. Sorry. There's no hearts on that one. Bitch. One day. Uh, I feel your pain now. I feel your pain. Do you? 
<laughs> We're the same health. He said now. Just got a more successful killer doesn't mean I don't feel pain like you. Although. We're bo <laughs> both in pain. If I'm he just, dies, he dies. I've just caused more. Okay, let's calm down here. But I'm just saying, like, Whoa. just because you have more souvenirs doesn't mean that you won't die the same. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, I mean, that's true. Do it, Amy. Go for your diamond lake. Do what you're doing, okay? You keep on stepping. You do what you're doing, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Remember, clear the board, get them to all come back. I mean, if you ever get there, then we can. Yeah, she'll probably beat me there. It's fine. You know, honestly. Beat you where? Well, I'm not from to the road. No, I meant Jules will probably beat me to the road. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Uh, you got Diamond Lake pretty much all. Yeah, you just needed the one to get it all to yourself. What? One fist. You got it. You got triple? Yep, no, no. You didn't. Okay, I survived. What does triple fisticuffs do? Uh, you've seen the other two. It does. The player not only fails to kill the victim, but also loses one health and is sent to the nearest starting point on the board. Oh. Is that really one? Three? Sounds bad. Yep. Oh, I don't like so, it. So, don't you get your thing and then roll again? Do I? I didn't Maybe you don't pick. get three fists. I, I was going to say, even if that's what you need to win the challenge, good God. Do I get to go again, even though I didn't necessarily kill the dog? I thought you did, because you got two no, fists. No, she just survived one. the attack. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. it's only like the kill. I'm mm -hmm. taking souvenir. Yeah, I survive, I don't thrive. Yeah, right. Right. Three forward. Yeah. yeah. I don't know why I remember, I thought this game had like two die that you moved with. But no, I guess that <sighs> makes sense, huh? Only on playing this game, dogs. Does that give you an extra movement die? Theoretically. You're like, it comes with another red <laughs> guy, so I mean, theoretically. Yeah, I and you got yeah, double the board, right. so. <laughs> right? Like, we're moving double the space, <laughs> like I don't think so. Thank God, you got it. Can he do it? What? Yes. If he didn't, I was going to be like, oh. <laughs> about to rage. Well, the builder will be fresh. Wrong guy. Yeah, sneak in. Sure. <laughs> what are you trying to do? I Who are you trying idea. to get? Six. I've never done this before, okay? Sounds familiar. You gonna brawl? I should have brawl. I'm, not going to. I'm pretty sure you have to brawl if you're right there. If you're next, next to him? him? I thought you got to choose. Only in the location. Brawl occurs when players land on the same space. I'm not on the same space. The space is next to each other. Let me finish. Okay. Or in the same location. Go backward. Go diagonal. Go diagonal. I can't count. <laughs> he can't go diagonal. No, I'm saying if he's diagonal, oh, me, we can't okay. fight him. Yeah, you don't have to use all your movement, I don't think. I could go. Oh, yeah, you could. There you go. I just hope she doesn't go with three. How she does. Really anything more than a one, she's gonna fuck someone. Hmm. Wait, why? Who? Well, Should she'll be near both of you. <laughs> oh, near us, yeah. yeah. True. Is that like a keep it kind of card? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. So my favorite, actually. Yeah. I don't know if anyone's played the ring game before. Just enough. Let's try this. One one yes. night, just can I do this? All right. Plus. You did it. Oh, thank you. The plus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one. Is it good? Uh, she uses it. Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Yeah, that one. 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 Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I was like, okay. actually, here's what you do. You leave and you just stay at the entrance and they have to come to you. This is for all folks. What does the bomb do? Uh, I think we all take damage. What? I think we're only taking one. Oh. She'll take two and we all take one? Yeah, so the current player, if unsuccessful, loses two health and one souvenir. And then all the players lose one souvenir. And if you don't have a souvenir, you lose one health. Oh, okay. Just get two fists. Like, <laughs> let's just avoid everything. Hey, three hey, fists. Hey. But I got three fists. So you survive that, but something else happens. I don't think it does anything to you. Okay, that's only if on the uh, 
That's only if you're attacking a victim. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so you're good. But, but you survived. <laughs> so. Fuck that survivor. So I don't get to pick up anything though, do I? No. no. I don't get to even kill. Nope. It's the survivor. You don't kill the survivor. You survive the survivor. <sighs> I don't like this. this I am a survivor. <laughs> <laughs> Roll into it. Where do you want to go? Yeah. <laughs> He's just hopping down this between the two. What is that? Uh, town Square and the high school? Five. Ooh, nice roll. Then back to the sewers. <laughs> Where no, I do not too far. I'm surprised Smiley's on the sewers one. I'm actually not surprised Smiley's ability doesn't have anything to do with sewers. Right? Yeah. You'd think so. Mm-hmm. I mean, based off Pennywise. So, being diagonal, I don't have to fight? No, because you can't move diagonally, so. Okay. Just kidding, it's okay. Psych! But now I can move in range. One, two, three. <laughs> Maybe I'll risk this now. So you die. No, I just return to the nearest starting point. <laughs> God damn it. Big moves. Big money. Sunlight. Way to kill the mood. Alright, Amy. You want this? Just just you want it? Want it? Last time I asked, I got survivor. <laughs> but there's You throw that in just two oh, two okay. uh, fuck is that? Two knives. Come on, Amy. Come on. Nope. 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 I don't lose anything. But I'm just hanging out. We believe in you. Come on, Tyler, make it to the end of the street. souvenirs it's just one space to get through the locations okay sorry i forgot to mention that so really this, that this way, way. Yep. one two three mm-hmm. okay i have them just swoop on out of there <laughs> at this rate yeah i feel like at this point we're all just kind of waiting on you to get that one i tried <laughs> it's been three rolls <laughs> they were all just kind of waiting for you to kill someone over there amy could we just be better I appreciate it. Keep it up. <laughs> Used to both and keep it I up. I didn't do anything! You told me you did. Oh, wow. <laughs> Alright, Amy, you want this? Oh, it's my turn again? I, fuck it. Let's go. You just need two knives. <laughs> kill the shiny children. Come At on. least they're not costing me help. Ah, yeah. Double the pleasure, double the fun, double the pleasure, double the fun. Oh, no. Nah. What's that? So double the pleasure, double the fun. Okay. But I had to say it twice. So the double effect. I was like, I want that fucking hell. <laughs> Either that or he's gonna try and swoop. I need this. She put me on the house, please. Never mind, she's getting the health. Wait, was that five? She didn't yeah. use all her movement. Okay. There's only three. Is that burning down the house? That song? Yeah. I don't know if that's the name of the song. It's by the Talking Heads, whatever that song is. It might be Burned Out the House, though. <laughs> I think, no, you mentioned it. I think it is. Oh, no! Yeah, they have Burned Out the House. Burned Out the House. Pass my turn. You want this? Yeah, like, bring it on. <laughs> Just do it. You need a fist to survive. You can't even kill anybody this time. <laughs> God damn it. Next time you hand the card to her. Okay. <laughs> can I just redraw it? <laughs> Come on, fist to cuffs. Yeah. I survived. All right. Tyler, At what cost? <laughs> damn it, I should use my special ability. What are you doing? You gonna go in there? You want a fighter? You want a fighter? You want a fighter? <laughs> Just double your health, but you want to fight her. <laughs> I haven't killed you yet. Well, you're gonna have to try. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Enemies being made, uh oh. I got nothing to lose. Oof. 
Yeah, you, you sure do. about that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do. <laughs> Alright, a life to lose. Yep, there it is. So do you take two damage from that? Uh, no, just one. Okay, yeah, one sure goes for every die. Yeah, high risk, high reward, you know? No, I mean, yeah, you gotta do yeah. what you gotta do. Really, I'm just trying to give you incentive to finish that fucking flake. Right? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm trying. <laughs> that, and either way, I was gonna get into a brawl, because I had to deal with, with either her Can or her. Can you backtrack in a turn? Yeah. Like, if she got two, could she go one and back on it? Oh, I... Or does she need to go the same direction the next turn? I, 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 I feel, feel like it's one direction, it. unless yeah. you go, like, like, a be kinda, square. That'd be kind of shitty if you're yeah. the person who just keeps hopping on and off the health Because thing. we tried to do that, I think, last time. Yeah, I feel like we asked that last time. Yeah, we decided I don't, I don't think so. It's not, it's not the way to play. Did you just go? Mm -hmm. No. Roll the one. I don't know if I want to go, though. Two. Yeah, what do you got against Jules' character? You like knocked her off the board. <laughs> just, just, I was hanging in there barely. <laughs> Teetering on the edge. When Gavs pass, like one, two. You can do bonus tracks. But I can't backtrack? No. Well, that's why you can get the bonus track. Oh, I want the bonus track. Well, then I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> what do you want then, Derek? I want to stay right here so I can go to one of these on the things well, we set. Well, then just go <laughs> yeah, into just the set and go in a circle. But then I get a bonus track. One, two, one, two. three, four. Okay, I guess that puts me farther away, I guess. That's okay. I would have the bonus track, but... <laughs> nah, what if it makes me lose a souvenir? <laughs> can I please reject the bonus track? Alright. <laughs> Got this, Amy. Oh! <laughs> Never mind, you lose two health. She'll let Tyler kill you. He'd have been out of the game. <laughs> true. That's true, actually. <laughs> He'd have been out of the game. It's fucking she, gets, she still stays there, though, right? Why, yeah. why have I gotten all the shitty cards? <laughs> Bonus tracks. Cowabunga. Move your character to the nearest to her shortcut. Blue? Yeah. Do you use it too? Bam. Yeah. No. no, so it's next turn you can. Oh. Thanks. Just oh. try and put me in there with her. Oh, okay. oh brawl! Uh oh! It's going down. One. Are you better off than I was? Mm -hmm. Alright. Alright. Two. Two. <laughs> way to spin so you around. lose a health and you go back to the. So nearest, you can't so. kill victims, but you can kill other killers. Look, I. Right, she's killed both of y'all, but she was like some real deck survivor. <laughs> All right, Jaybird. Thank you for coming to my pet talk. <laughs> I'm Amy's just gonna win simply by killing everybody. He's like, I'm just gonna hop between these places in a row. Pretty much. Not a good strategy. <laughs> Mentally. That's what I was doing when I got greedy. Yeah, yeah bye bye. Alright, Ames. Go on, Ames. Ames. Change. Oh, okay, you, you can do this. Hopefully. No, I thought I guess I'm gonna kill her. She won't do it. She did it! I did it! Yeah. Alright! Fuck yeah. There we go! And I get to roll again. You played into his hands. So now we're putting him on every space. Yep. Does she immediately get to go for the one that's already on there again? I can't imagine. No. I'd have to call out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that one. Mm, oh, yeah. Three. Four. Four. Two. Yeah. And I roll again. That's why I don't skip rocks. Five. <laughs> I don't skip rocks. You use a sword. You can get health. You could punch Jay Fred in the face. Could do that. Ten. Oh, because you have double that's true. Bam. Let's see if I survive negative two health. Can continue. Oh my goodness. She doesn't get two fists. She oh, might not be able to the first one out. Come on. Uh, uh, I don't like Dang. Oh, she made it. She made it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how I'm doing oh, this. Ten. Hey, it all matters is you are. Thank you. Four. Just creeping up the alley again. Yeah. That's the way Jason's way. I should have used my ability, really. No, but I couldn't. I don't know as well. 
progress. I'm just hoping you get a shitty drawing, Tom, like I'm thinking. I mean, I might, honestly. I don't know. All right. What you get? I get two knives. Oh, three. You get two souvenirs. Hey, don't do it. You ought to make a dad. Because I don't want to hear. Because I don't want to hear. I need, two, I need two knives. Don't give him two knives. Don't give him two knives. Don't give him two knives. Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay. So now it's your turn. And <laughs> oh, I okay. am going to use my special ability on Derek. You have to use it during my turn. I can use it at the beginning of my turn. So it's during that player's turn. I am uh, target any one player on the board, and for every knife you successfully roll, the player chosen loses one health. The ability oh. must be used at the start of the player's turn. Once the player has rolled the action dice and the effects are made, their turn is over. Player's turn or player's turn? I think it's her turn. Oh, no, the target is that and yeah. her turn. Yeah. I think oh, you, using you, her you turn use your turn to, to use, use that. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Like, I, I would, I would then, lose. Yeah. I'm not going to draw a card. Yeah. On their turn, you would do that. Oh, okay, okay. So what does it do? I have to roll knives. If I roll one knife, you get lose one. If I roll two knives, you lose two. Oh, okay. And if I roll three, you lose three. It's equivalent. Gotcha. I want to. It's I don't. Murky, dude. Yeah, I'm a I, Yeah, it's either that or you end up winning. Now, if you win first. Jeez. I have <laughs> three. <laughs> you need one, that one. I'm going to try Maybe and get you. You're trying to make an enemy. That's not cool. A friend of me. No, there's no friend of me, dude. This is 100% enemy. I'm pretty sure if you lose an enemy, if he kills you. Uh, you lose one. Uh, I'll kill you. I tried. I'm going to come auto kill you. It's the uh, it's the heart of the cards. The good it's thing is as well is that he can't attack me even if I did kill him because it's not technically a brawl. Until it's my turn. And I can get you. Oh man, he's, he's got you where he wants you. Good right job. next to me. <laughs> Card please. Fist to cut. Oh fuck. And a roll. <laughs> oh, <my gosh. laughs> oh thank god, okay. Oh, because you only have one health left, don't yeah. you? <laughs> Alright. Alright. Let's turn. Ah! Damn, <laughs> well, also the bang down there scared me too. Fuck that. Yeah. Um, Welcome to hard, Hardcore Floors of My Dogs. Two. One, two. Solid. Have you thought about your special ability? You going for a card again, or what are you doing? Okay. Yeah. No, you can help one more. One night. One night. Oh, one night. Okay. Got karate kid fighting you. Do you have Hmm? Yeah. What three is three fists? fists? Oh, sure. Three fists? You know, when he's trying to kill somebody? Uh. I think it means you fail. Oh, when you're done. And everybody? Is that one that takes actually, blue, right? fails and takes double damage? Uh, the player not only fails to kill the victim, but also loses one health and is sent to the nearest starting combat okay. board. Yeah. Alright, there you go. One health and a souvenir. So you can, you can choose whichever one of these you want to go to. I don't think it's a souvenir. They no, you, you just lose one health. Oh. Uh, a little bit of one. Surprise there. Oh, I guess because that's the health right there, yeah. Did you take out one of the healths? No, he, yeah, I did. I think you did. Yeah. Okay. You did have a health, right? I did not. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It was... Take the gamble. Oof. I need two skulls. Oh, nice. Yes! Uh, Game! Nice try, Amy. <laughs> nice try! Look. I just. Booyah! <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter, clowns never die. Uh, they live on in hell. Part of the cards are not with us in that one. Yeah, I know. Part of, <laughs> part of the die. Like Dungeon dice monsters. <laughs> You know, at least like you want these in the knives or out? Out. Okay. They got their own bag. Oh, they have a bag here. Yeah. Cool. But yeah, so that's a mixing master. Real fun. So. Yeah, it's it's a fun game. I always enjoy playing it. There's some bags. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
you need assistance? It's hard to grab hold. There we go. There we go. Good. Teamwork. So thank you for joining us on this game night. Hope you had a good time. I know this one ran a little bit later than usual, but the next day massacre was worth it. Happy spooky season. <laughs> so we'll see you guys in a couple weeks. Until then, have a good rest of the night. Stay, Stay spooky. <laughs> <laughs>